Hello everyone! Happy Sunday. I set this... Okay. It's the briefest eye catch or demo mode I've ever seen in any game. Um, the title of this stream is subject to censorship. Well, I haven't got any notifications that anything's restricted. So... So, hope so. Uh, or hope not, anyway. It'd be kind of funny if I play the uncensored version of this game on a stream that gets censored. So, um... Hello, everybody. Uh, I apologize that none of you were able to watch the Molehill Mountain podcast live last night because um, the video was accidentally set to private. Is that all my fault? Yes. I mean, one could argue that YouTube should probably pop up a notification of some sort warning you that you're trying to live stream a private video. It doesn't, so I didn't notice. I did notice that nobody was watching, which I've done several hundred podcasts, live podcasts now, and. I've never had zero people watch before, so I was like, is there a game on tonight? <laughs> but anyway, uh, oops, that, that one's on me. Sorry for that, but this one is public. Got a few people in the chat. I can actually see a number of people watching, so that's good. All right, so <clears throat> next week we will uh, start in on Trails in the Sky the Third, but this week we're going to play some Tokyo Mirage Sessions Sharp FE. But we're going to play the uncensored version. For those of you who might remember, when this game came out six, seven years ago, uh, the North American release had some weird changes. Um, for example, uh, Vagina Bones, which is the always classy Internet's label for a for an animation riff. It, basically, a line that denotes the difference between a fit character's hips and their lower abdominals. So, a lot of times, you will have a fit character who is having, whose pants are really low and are having no shirt or an exposed stomach, and there will be lines drawn right here, and that's to denote the separation between the lower abdominals and the hips. It's a very common riff in animation, you see it all the time. For the North American release of this game, Subasa's vagina bones were erased. Why? Don't know. Did anyone complain? Has anyone ever complained about that? Not that I've ever seen. That is an incredibly common riff amongst a bunch of cartoons. Hell, Link in Breath of the Wild has vagina bones. So... Uh, there's other, there's some costuming changes where uh, Tsubasa, I think, at one point is wearing essentially a bra and a, a vest or something like that, and they gave her a shirt. But she also wears a swimsuit in other parts of the game, so... So, anyway, uh, this is the version of the game that uh, reverted all those changes to how they appear in the original Japanese version of the game. Oh, Lou said I uh, so vagina is something that's is a word that isn't uh, allowed in the chat. Actually, let me see if uh Whoop, yeah, yeah, I see it. Yeah, YouTube uh, Lou said you wouldn't want to keep your vagina bones private, would you? <laughs> yeah. Um so yeah, YouTube is censoring the word vagina, so V bones, I guess. Uh, Scrungle, hello. Woke up late, stayed up till 5 a.m. making my D&D &D character. Oh, fun. Um, alright, so... You might be wondering... How did I get an, a, a, an uncensored version of the game? Well, I do own this game. Here it is right here. And here's the disc. And you might be saying, well, how are you playing the game if the disc is in the case? Well, I'm playing it off an SD card. So, essentially what I did is I ripped all of the data off of the disk and onto my PC, patched the files, 
with the files from the Japanese version of the game, copied it onto an SD card, and loaded, used a kernel exploit in the Wii U so that I could load other programs off of the SD card. So this game is running off of an SD card that's plugged into the Wii U. All for Subasa's vagina bones. They're important. So, I have actually, whoop, hang on, let me change my lighting so I can see what I'm doing. I haven't played this game in a few years. It's one of the games that I never finished. Uh, yep, you made it in time. We haven't started yet. Uh, but as you can see, uh, I've put nearly 50 hours into this game. My characters are up around level 40. Um... But I haven't played in a few years, so we're going to go ahead and start from the beginning. Because um, I haven't played this in a while. So, here we go. Tokyo Mirage Sessions Sharp FE. What does that mean? It's kind of a cross between um, you know, Tokyo Mirage Sessions, TMS. Um, oh god, what, what is the name of the game? Um, uh, 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 it's backwards. TMS, SMT, Shin Megami Tensei. Effie is Fire Emblem. So there's kind of a crossover going there. Unruly Poi! I'm happy to buy followers and primes and viewers on mstream.store. But only if you invite a bunch of your friends to watch my stream and like it and subscribe and follow and hit the notification bell and super chat me money. So there you go. Well, my first bot for today. Alright. Scrungle says, Cute girls are cute, and if censorship destroys that, then I'll never forgive Sony. <laughs> well, to be clear, the censorship in this game, the cute girls are still cute. But the censorship doesn't make any sense. Like, it, it's it's just really weird and un... It, it's weird and unnecessary. I mean, your mileage may vary. You may prefer that animated characters do not have any line art that denotes a difference the, 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 where their abdominals end and their hips begin. Maybe that line is very offensive to you. I've never met anyone who's bothered by that, but maybe that's you. Maybe you're not bothered by a 17-year-old in a swimsuit but you are bothered by a 17-year-old in a bra and jacket for some reason. I, I don't know. Let's start, let's play a video game. All right, select the difficulty. Nope. Uh, difficulty of the battles does not affect the story. Okay. Start the game with which difficulty? Uh, It, normal's fine. Yep. Normal. Yes. <laughs> I'm glad they actually... It wasn't clear to me which one was highlighted, but they do have a little select thing on the left side, so there we go. Select. Yes. But The Last of Us 2, graphic sex and very graphic violence is okay? It's strange. Well, that game's not on the Switch, so, or the Nintendo console, so... Eh. Uh, well, also, there's no nudity in this game, so... Uh... Now, if it was an underage kid who was topless, okay, I, I could under... That would at least... I could understand where that's coming from, but that's not what this game is. This is about a 17-year-old kid who's in modeling... Who's an idol, you know, modeling, fashion, singing... And she has some skimpy duds that she wears on occasion. You may not like that. Fine, but that's the, a, a thing. But here's the thing. They didn't change it to be not sexy or not skimpy. They just changed some weird things that don't change anything. It's just changed for the... It's just weird. Anyway. Video games. <laughs> no nudity. Lose out. Link's V-Bones were on the Switch. They were. They were on the Wii U and the Switch. In all their glory. Both of them. 
Because we all have two. <laughs> One on either side. Oh no, she got raptured. There's also a 14-year-old uh, girl in this game who's really sexy, but it's okay because she's actually a thousand-year-old dragon. None of her outfits were changed. <laughs> Tita, Tifa, I, I forget what her name is. As she, you'll know her when you see her. That face when everyone's raptured but you. <laughs> Chicago, this is a work of fiction. Bye. Did I forget to turn on subtitles? I don't remember if this is in Japanese or English. There she is. Now there's like a uh, social media app where your friends text message you, and it all happens on the Wii U gamepad, so I'll, I'll try and show some of that off. That's going to be a little difficult to do though, but you know, I'll do what I can. Pan down, let's see those vagina bones. Reincarnation. Tiki, that's what it is. Can you guess which character is important? <laughs> Did I ever get my new used Wii? Uh, yeah. Uh, but I'm probably going to return it because a friend of mine actually had an extra that he's going to uh, try to get to me, so. Some kind of event, huh? I should probably not voice this since he's already talking, so. No. Oh. Here, here we go. We can see it a little bit. So we've got a phone app with text messages on there, and my tablet is uh, vibrating and stuff. So okay. Uh, Tsuki uh, carries a communication tool with him called Topic. This tool is linked to the Wii U gamepad in your possession. When you receive a message on Topic, you can use the Wii U gamepad to access it. Okay, so we will read the urgent topic. 
Okay, so we've got a little uh, text message app going on here, so I'll, I'll read it. So uh, Itsuki says, aren't you two overreacting a little? And Toma says, hey, we're all friends here. What's wrong with wanting to all hang out? Well, guess that means tomorrow's gonna be us guys out on town. Blah, sorry, running late. Seriously, just got off stage. So new topic. Toma says, sorry, man. Ah, and I was the one who set this whole thing up, too. And what I kind of like is, um... This is, this is written with poor punctuation and spelling, so I is not capitalized and there's no period at the end of the sentence. It's not hard to read, but it really gives it that text message flavor. I think that's a nice touch. Itsuki, rep uh, okay, so Itsuki, we can choose what reply we want. Uh, we can say, don't worry about it, or, well, I'm going home. So, well, I'm going home. Come on, man, don't be so pissed about it. I'm apologizing, right? Please? And they, they send little uh, emojis and stuff. Joking, don't worry, says Itsuki. Oh, BTW, I saw someone who looked a lot like Tsubasa in uh, Odaiba today. Did she tell you anything about her pants? Plants! <laughs> It says plans! <laughs> Not pants, plans! Did she, <laughs> did she tell you anything about her plans? Uh, Itsuki responds, nope. Uh, Toma says, eh, it was probably someone else then. Anyhow, I'll be there as soon as I can, so just hang on a little more. <laughs> and uh, another little, uh... Oh, it disappeared, okay. Uh, he, he put a little emoji out. Guess I'll just wander around a bit then. Oh, there she is. Tsubasa? Tsubasa? Oh, he already said Tsubasa. Obtained a play record. Welcome to... Oh, I, I got a, an emoji. Anyway, here's the, uh, the little thing he sent. Here I go! All right, so what else do we have in here? We've got contacts. Oh, okay, so in our contacts we have Toma. Uh, oh, Itsuki re responded to... Uh... Okay, so we've got a bit of a chat history. So uh, Toma, whose profile says, Today an extra, tomorrow a hero. I am Toma Agaki. And Toma says, Arg. Itsuki, what's up? Toma, what are you acting all calm for, calm for? You know we have a test tomorrow. Holy crap, I am not sleeping tonight. Why don't you study then? What? You feel like you're ready for it? Eh, so-so, I'd say. Wow, this crap again? Yeah, I can tell you've been studying your ass off. No, seriously, I haven't had a lot of time for that. There's no time to waste. Gotta use these final moments to cram as much as I can. Rah! And here I go. And he goes, best of luck to you. But we also have some uh, chats from uh, Tsubasa here. So here's uh, Tsubasa, whose pants are very interesting. <laughs> Brian says, Andrew, I have to tell you something about my pants. <laughs> Lou says she knows where my mind is. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, the Wii U game... Whoop. I mean, uh, might have missed some stuff here. Yeah, uh, Wii U gamepad is built in webcam, speakers and mic. It could have been a great resource uh, during the pandemic. People struggled with Zoom. That's true. There, There is a camera right here. There's a, where's the mic? Uh, right here. I think there were some some chat apps that this used, but yeah. Uh, Chicago, the texting feature must be a pain in the neck with the Switch. You probably have to pause the game to read and reply. I would imagine so. I don't know. Anyway, Tsubasa says, Itsuki, how's studying going? You ready for the next test? Uh, eh, it's going okay. How about you, Tsubasa? We only have tests in two subjects tomorrow, so I just finished reviewing. Now I'm going to sleep early. With a little emoji. There's three subjects tomorrow. English, literature, and math. Tsubasa. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Tsubasa? I forgot math! Uh, capital D and eight? Uh, oh, that that's a sideways emoji. And... <laughs> Kind of emoji. All right. Actually, I probably blocked it out of my mind because I don't want to think about it. And he says, well, good luck. And we've got a map. 
which currently is just a circle. So, anyway. <clears throat> All right. Hello, citizen. The final auditions are about to start. Everyone in the audience, this way, please. Okay. I don't care about 3D girls. Utaloid Tiki is the best. I wish I could compose so I could make her sing for me. Okay. The Utaloid Tiki's made of dreams, not data. If she was just a fictional idol, she wouldn't be this popular. Can I... Let's see. What does this button do? Oh, well, here's the menu. What's interesting is on that we'll probably see it a bit, but notice how this uh, menu system, we've got um, Itsuki lying in a, in a flowery field. Just just keep that in mind for later. Is the capital D in the emoji equal to eight? No, it, it, it's, it's just the D followed by the A. So. <laughs> uh, honestly, my sister thinks she can become an idol just by coming here says the escorting man. I want to be just like Mamarine. I really, really want to be like her. Okay. Should I shoot it anyways? Uh, well, now you're... An elevator that leads outside. I guess I'll just kill some time until Toma gets here. Alright, so... It's Tsubasa. Tsubasa! Tsubasa-san! Now, what I was wondering about is, do I have, like, a first-person look here? Don't... Click, 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 click... No. Don't seem to. There. Just trying to get a look at the... No. One of Millennium. It's the idol audition being held here today. The line is made up of people waiting to get into this. Poster for the Utaloid Tiki. It's popular online. With a program like this, anyone can compose songs. Uh, Kyria's song got first place on the charts three weeks in a row. That's so amazing! If you pass this audition, then you might be able to work together with Kyria, right? My friend's auditioning too. I'm looking forward to seeing her. Poster for the stage show of the live-action hero, Masquerader Raiga. Alright. Yep. Oh, here we go. Reincarnation is always at the top of the charts, seems like. Let's see. Now, Kyria here. Let's wait for it to cycle. See this outfit that she's wearing? I think in the original Japanese she's wearing, like booty shorts or underwear or something. I think they gave her pants in the uh, the, the remake or, or the, the, the Japanese version so so that's another one of the changes because we would we would never here in America we don't see any of our pop stars in their underwear. That, that never happens. What's this game rated? Rated team? Yeah. Hi Tsubasa. Japanese, such a succinct dialect, succinct language, yeah. Whoop, let me get the mouse out of it. <laughs> like a deer in the headlights. Um, hello, there we go. Huh? Itsuki-kun? Itsuki-kun? Alright. Um, our pop stars dress worse. Some of them do. Um, uh, let me know in the chat if you want uh, the the. Do you want me to read the voiced dialogue? It's voiced in Japanese. Do you, do you want me to wait till their line read is done and then read it myself? 
or are you happy just reading the voice dialogue for yourself? L let me know. Currently what I'm doing is, if the line is voiced, I'll just let it play and let you read it. Uh, but if it's not voiced, I'll read it myself. Uh, let me know if you want me to do something different. <laughs> I'm pretty happy with this this um, idling animation I may leave her there for a while because it's funny. Alright. <laughs> Yeah, pretty awesome. Who? Kiria? Tashka Tsubasanga Skina Kashu Dake. If it's not voice read okay. <clears throat> Let's see. Brian prefers I read it. Uh, uh Scrungle says romance Tsubasa, this is my first <laughs> okay. I don't think that's this kind of I, I don't think that's a thing in this game, but anyway. Uh, she's cute, right? Uh, Scrungle's branding her best girl. Go ahead and read it. Okay. I lyrically see. Alright. Kyria, that was that singer you really like, right? I've been telling you to listen to her songs forever. How do you still not remember? She's one of the biggest female artists in Japan right now. And she performs sans pants. Have I told you about my pants? Really impressive vagina bones. You should really listen to her sometime, Itsuki. Itsuki? Rather, my pronunciation of that word, of that name is not very good. I'll uh, get around to it. Promise? Yeah, yeah. Don't yeah, yeah me. You're just saying that to get me off your case. <laughs> There's a face that haunts my nightmares. <laughs> that is the Itsuki I am disappoint face. <laughs> ah, come on, Itsuki. We've been friends since we were kids. Can't you take me seriously for once? Oh, that that's an even more... <laughs> that's, that's the I'm about to shiv you look. <laughs> Uh, if you have the Wii U version, it's the censored version. I I think uh, Tokyo Mirage Sessions F Sharp FE Encore, the Switch version, I think it retains all of the changes that were made for the uh, North American Wii U release. I think. Not completely sure about that. But none of the changes affect the game any. They're just a couple weird cosmetic changes. You know, I went to the trouble of hacking my Wii uh, to get the original costumes and stuff in there. More out of principle of the thing, because, you know, if the creative team changed their minds about how a particular outfit looked... Like, some of the earliest media of uh, Tokyo Mirage Sessions showed, like, um, a zipper on uh, uh, Kyria's underwear pants, I think. And that was changed for the final game, or I may have that backwards. That's not censorship. That's just a creative changing their mind. Going, eh, you know what, I think I like it better this way. That's perfectly fine. But when the game was brought over to America, they're like, uh, I predict someone will complain, so erase Tsubasa's vagina bones. <laughs> Uh, lyrically says, what, which part was censored? Well, Tsubasa has a cleavage-bearing outfit in this game, so they gave her a shirt. But she's also in a bikini in several other parts of the game, so... It, it's that kind of a thing. Just, just a few, uh, some of the posters in the back... In Chapter 2, I think, a lot of the posters in the background are, are of uh, swimsuit and lingerie models. I think they changed a lot of the posters. 
I mean, this character, I think, is 17, so... Uh, hang on a second, I need to blow my nose. I've been leaky all day. Excuse me for a moment, won't you? And of course her vagina bones were erased. Which is like erasing cheekbones. Or, you know, lines on your abdomen, ab abdomen to denote abdominal muscles. Like, erasing that. It's just weird. <laughs> anyway. Okay, got it. If you don't listen to Kyria, we're getting parfait. Your treat. Make sure it's extra large. <laughs> I mean, I'll get you a parfait if you want. I just don't see why you're trying to get me excited about her. It makes perfect sense. I just want to talk about curious stuff with you. That makes sense. I mean, that's probably enough about her, so what exactly are you doing here in Daitama again? Ah, I thought I threw him off the trail with talks of parfait. <laughs> well, you know, just things and stuff. I, I adore this animation here. All applicants for the One of Millennium Idol edition, please gather in the reception area. <laughs> I just remembered that something I had to do, so, uh, gotta go! Bye! Tsubasa? Tsubasa? Tsubasa Nova? You didn't tell me about your pants! Sounds like something's going on in the back. If Toma's going to be a while, I might as well check it out. Poster for Kyria, an artist who's been popular lately. Seems she'll be doing a concert in Shibuya soon. Emphasis on the booya. <clears throat> Perfectly normal. Ladies and gentlemen, your finalists for the One of Millennium Idol Discovery Audition, I am your host, Teru Gojuin. Probably should have listened to him actually pronounce that name, because I'm not doing well. Which talented contestant will get the glory of victory and a shot at stardom? Are you ready? Yay! So am I. My body is ready. Seems the idol audition hosted by Go Gojuin Gojuin has begun. I like world peace and tacos. I'm playing Tetris or Candy Crush or something. What would I do if I found myself stalked by a headed figure in a mirror? Hmm. Good question. Stay away from here. Maybe Moon the hooded figure. I get it to go away. Next up, number four, Tsubasa Oribe. Whoa. 
she looks really nervous. And she's got, like, her hair held in place by one barrette and several other rubber bands. Uh, eh? Tsubasa? Tsubasa. Uh, I'm. That's my name. Pleased to meet. Me's to plead you. <laughs> uh, people embarrassed to talk in front of audiences. Great. We revel in your discomfort, Sibasa. I messed that up. What's Sibasa doing on stage? And why is there a ghost behind her? Huh? Eh? And why is her collarbone glowing? And where did I learn to dress myself? What was that? Tsubasa, what are you doing here at this audition? Uh, tell us, Tsubasa, what kind of star did you want to be? I... I want to become an idol that can make everyone happy. Parfaits for all. Whoa, that's original. Wow, just what motivated you to be that kind of idol? We're just dying to know, aren't we, folks? Yes. Well, a while ago, I went through some hard times and got really depressed. Everyone was really worried about me, but that just ended up feeling more like a burden. That can't happen, yeah. But I had a friend that still talked with me like everyone was nor like everything was normal, just like he always did, and he bought me really big parfaits. That cheered me up, and it helped feel like I could smile. It helped me feel like I could smile again. That's why I want to be able to help everyone smile, just like my friend did for me. Parfaits for all! She's not talking about you, Itsuki. By the way, why don't you tell us what it was that made you so depressed? <laughs> what, did someone die? Huh? Well, um... Is it maybe something to do with your sister? Gasp! Your sister is the idol, uh, Aiha Oribe, isn't she? Yeah, that's true. Also, the butcher of Shibuya. <laughs> Well, why didn't you say so? This is very important information, so tell us, what kind of sister was she? Why are you standing in front of her? We can't see her! She was always cheerful, a great singer, and most importantly, she was a very kind person. Until she and the entire audience was raptured, and I was blamed for the deaths of 300 people. But, five years ago, during that so-called mass disappearance, your sister disappeared, didn't she? Yeah, my sister disappeared during the mass disappearance. Hey, these questions are getting a little weird. Isn't the mass disappearance where all the performers and audience in the, in the theater just disappeared? In mass? <laughs> Stop. A girl whose heart cries out for her missing sister. Oh, so tragic, so beautiful. Oh, my heart strings. But here, now, here, we come to the most important question of all. Tsubasa-san, for your incredible talent, I could let you see your beloved sister once again. How about it? Nothing suspicious. The truth is, I have called Miss Aiha Oribe to be our special guest today! 
<laughs> Lou says, I love the characterization as informed crowd, yeah. Or suspicious crowd. Huh? She, she's here? Uh, no, is what he said. I'm just kidding. Sorry, I was distracted by the funny animation. And everyone dies, and that's the end of the game. Very short game, but... Ah, uh, stop, you can't... Uh... What's going on? No, ah! Wah ha ha, get to it, lads! Grab it all! I want all the performer these humans got. <laughs> Lou says, well, this took an unexpected turn. <laughs> it went full anime immediately. <laughs> what was I play? Oh, um, um, Astral Chain. Boy, does that go even more anime towards the end. Holy crap. I mean, you think that's an anime game, but <laughs> it's like, oh, you thought you thought the first ten chapters of this game were anime? Oh no, we ain't even begun to anime. Uh, what's happening? Yeah. Huh? Hmm. I know that scream. Up oh, there she is. Gah. <laughs> Don't let her escape now. That little girlie's gonna make a fine vessel for her. Yeah, yo. Help me, Itsuki kun. And Toma's very late. What is going on? <clears throat> Tsubasa! Tsubasa! Oh. I have a parfait for you! Yep, here we go. Alright. I, I was going for the shinies, but I can't walk over all the, all the corpses. Is this the thing? No? Alright. Well, we're leaving. I'm out. I am out. We're just gonna nope on it. Oh. Eh, nothing to say, huh? Well, they're alive. They're fine. Oh, we're gonna rescue- okay. We're gonna be the hero. I thought video games were supposed to be about choice. I was just gonna peace out, but, uh... You know, just nope on out of there. But apparently that's not an option. <clears throat> right before the math and English test as well. Some people have the worst luck, yeah. I have to... save her. All right, press Y to open the main menu. Wish to save prog progress. Yeah, save often because you are playing a hacked version of the game off of an SD card. So you know, be careful. So we'll just. Uh... Level one. I guess spoilers about who ends up in my party, but, you know. Hmm, alright, let's, let's check. Uh, 
Oh, hey, I forgot to read, um... Uh, Tsubasa's profile. I hope I get this. Hashtag trying something new. Hashtag not a diet. <laughs> oh, and we have a uh, summary here. <clears throat> Let's see. Uh, Itsukui A... Oh, oh, God, the name I'm terrible at. A-O-I, Aoi. Um, it's... Itsuki Aoi, uh, a high school student, is invited by his friend uh, Toma uh, Akagi to visit Daitama Observatory and visit uh, the event space at the TV station by the seaside. Uh, however, the meeting comes and goes. Toma's nowhere to be seen. Instead, sends a message that he's running late as Itsuki wanders around to kill some time. Eventually, runs into his friend Sabasa. She's there to participate in an amateur idol competition secret. However, spectral figures suddenly storm the stage and kidnap Tsubasa through an ominous portal. The situation seems dire, but Itsuki resolves to save his friend. Alright, Tsubasa was taken through here. Let's touch it. Yeah, every... all my math and uh, literature, whatever it was, um, I crammed and now I'm going to forget all of it. So now we're going to start getting an idea of what kind of game this is from a gameplay perspective. So we're going to start head in, heading into the major loop here. What is this place? Am I even in Daitama anymore? You have to hurry. Huh? She's in danger. You have to hurry to the depths. And you can be horny for me because I'm actually a thousand year old. A thousand years old. Who was that girl? Oh, she can wait. I have to find Tsubasa. Are you okay? Are you okay? What am I doing? I'm drawing in the... I have a map on my uh, uh, screen, so I'm wandering all over the place so that I can actually draw in each corner. Whoop. We're getting a phone call. Uh... Oh, it's from Toma! Hey, some weird stuff's going down in Daitama right now. Where are you? Is everything okay? It's good. I think I'm still in Daitama. I went through this weird gate thing and ended up in some huge place I've never seen before. Oh, crap. That's not good. You know this place? I can't explain right now, man. Itsuki, I need you to get out of there. Now. I don't really get it. But Spasa got kidnapped by some kind of monsters. I'm not just leaving her behind in here. Hey, come on, Itsuki. And we just put the phone down. Alright. Ah! What she said. Huh? <laughs> I will find these depths, and I will plunge them like a stubborn toilet food. She chose down. 
Is that wrong? Too late now. Uh, what was that? One of the idols. Ah. Not bad, not bad. Guess I should have expected as much from a vessel we picked out specially. Nice hat. It won't be long now till Zubasa's finished. No! Zubasa! Give me what? Your power. It is mine. Your power is mine. Ah! <laughs> yep, <laughs> there's a realistic reaction there. Ghost! Oh, my ankle! No machine. Hmm, that looks like a collectible. It's shiny and I want it. I sense a dangerous presence beyond this door. What should I do? Well, can't really do much else, so let's proceed. No, stop! Huh? Yokos. Give me your power, it's mine, your power is mine. Yokos. Yokos. Whoa. Yeah, hey, let me in. <laughs> ghost. Spooky ghost. My vagina bones. <laughs> oh, don't touch me with your disgusting, filthy soul. Let's see if anyone actually recognizes who this character is. Remember, this is Shin Megami Tensei and Fire Emblem. What the biscuits was I doing? <laughs> Go. I'll take care of them. Huh? But why are you... We don't have time to talk. Go! Rescue the girl! That one over there. Now. Maybe throw your filthy soul at her. Uh, but what can I do to save her? Hit him with one of his blue balls. There you go. You got two. Use the other one. Er, well, okay.
Tsubasa, shove your balls in her face. <laughs> Worked for me. <gasps> That's it. Balls to the face. <laughs> Recycled animation. <laughs> it's obviously Krom, <laughs> despite looking nothing like him. It's alright, Brian. Good job. They, the characters are heavily redesigned for this game. <laughs> Find someone that you can just look at meaningfully and nod. <laughs> Anime! <laughs> I'm such a sucker for this bullshit. <laughs> Boob physics! Whee! <laughs> but Chrome welding a falchion and not a spear. Yeah. How can I... Incredible... Talking sword! I, I know that voice. Are you that, uh, blue ghost from before? Yeah. Somehow it looks like I became a blade. This can't be real. Be careful. It's alright. I'm here with you. Now, come on! Bunny ears employed, that's right. Okay, so look at the logos. Are we seeing what they're doing here? So we, so Tsubasa is our spear user. Um, uh, Itsuki is our uh, sword user. So it's that weapons triangle from Fire Emblem. <laughs> Yeah, that wasn't subtitled, so I have no idea what the hell he said. Run away! Oh, that's... Okay, tactics? Tactics menu. Determine how Itsuki's allies will act during battle. If any other tactic... If any tactic other than commanding a character individually is chosen, that cast member will act according to the tactic assigned to him or her. Tactic can be set by pressing A, press the... Uh, auto battle militia. Right. Guard items. Probably don't have anything, right? Well, we've got a soft drink, which restores some HP. Skills. Zeo. It's a electric attack. All right. So let's just um, let's just attack. So we can see that we've got what looks like your typical RPG action bar along the top. So uh, we're gonna go, and then Sabas is gonna go, and then the enemies are gonna go. <laughs> So, we're on a stage, we've got a crowd of people watching, and we use spotlights to target stuff. And you'll notice... <laughs> shut up, V. And you'll notice that um, we don't know what these targets are yet, and you can see the various little uh, icons underneath. What we need to do as we play the game is attack with different weapons and different... So, for instance, uh, Itsuki has a sword, so we're going to hit it with a sword, and... Below the sword, it will change from a question mark to whether it's effective or not. And if it's not effective, then we'll try a spear, or we'll try the uh, electric magic, which is that lightning bolt over on the right side. So, let's, um... We've got two blobs. So let's try the blob. Let's hit it with a sword. It's weak. Okay. 
私が失敗しないと失敗しないと失敗失敗しないといいな。Okay, so you can see that underneath sword it says weak, so we know that that's a decent attack. So let's uh let's try with the uh, spear and see if that does anything. No. Okay, so we've got weak and then we've got indifferent. So I that's low enough that we can eh, let's do it. Go away. Right, how about you, big boy? Okay, weak to spear, that's good to know. Ouch. Okay, let's see how you like sword. Oh, weak to swords too, so that's helpful. Alright, what skills do we have? Okay, we've got healing, which restores HP. I'm not sure how much, but we're. I'm looking on the right side of the screen. We're both doing okay wise on health, so I think we're fine for right now. Okay, let's try our lightning attack. Lightning attack, rather. Weak to lightning. So you can see kind of how you start working this stuff out. The more you fight things, the more you learn about them, and you don't have to remember what everything's weakness is, which is nice. Alright, we leveled up. Got a little bit of experience in money. We got some blob force and crawling darkness. Don't, don't know what the hell that is. Alright, I, I gotta admit, so far this get, this does um, Trails in the Sky better. One of my critiques to Trails in the Sky is when you level up, at least in the first two Trails games, they'll probably change that the further I get into the series, but... Um, it actually tells me how my stats change as I level up, which is something I enjoy. Well, her stats didn't change terribly much, but... It's useful, and it makes feeling level up a lot more special, unless, like, just a random heal. <laughs> Pardon me. Looks like we managed to take them out. Ugh, now get your hand off my shaft, Itsuki. And it seems as though we're able to revert to these forms as well. Much of all this is still unclear, but my name is Crow. Brian was right! I could remember that much. Do we have any guesses on who the woman is? Krom, thank you. I couldn't have saved Tsubasa without you. I'm Itsuki. Itsuki Aoi. I... That triple vowel word is really difficult for me to say. And that's a really common name, too. Aoi. Aoi. Itsuki Aoi. Eh? Mm. Stop touching me with your balls. 
I should be the one thanking you. It was that light within you that freed me from the darkness. Lucina? Okay. We'll find out in just a sec. You have my gratitude, and it's a pleasure to meet you, Itsuki. Itsuki. Ah, yoroshiku, Kurome. Of course, likewise, Kurome. Or Kurome. Let's gaze meaningfully into each other's eyes. Not awkward at all. She's like, I'm here too. Seida. And yours was Tsubasa, right? So Lucina's a good guess, though. Huh? Oh, yes, I'm uh, Tsubasa Oribe. 17 years old. I think, um, if I'm not mistaken, I think another one of the changes made to um, this game for the North American release is they changed her dialogue to say she's 18 instead of 17. I mean, they didn't change the voice line. She still says 17, but the written dialogue says 18. So I think they aged up the characters in the text, and that was changed back. Um... Which is kind of weird. It's like, well, you know, she's 17, so the sexy outfits are a little weird. So that was one of the weird changes. It's like, well, I could understand, you know, she's 17, so you want to make the outfits less cleavage-tastic. Okay. But you already changed her age so that she's an adult, so why did you do both? That makes no sense. Cat- whoa, hello. The wall has the trifor- it does! <laughs> Uh, really sorry, Tsubasa. I must have scared you quite a bit, didn't I? You know, picking you up by the throat and stuff. Well, actually, yeah. That was really scary. But if it wasn't for you, who knows what would have happened to me back there. So, thank you, Miss Saito-san. Well, that's what Miss... You're a kind-hearted girl, Tsubasa. Sorry, but what exactly are you two? I mean, you attacked us and then you saved us after I rubbed my balls in your face. Oh, sorry. Can't even remember why I'm here in the first place. She did? Your memory gone too? Yeah, I've been trying to recall, but nope. Itsuki, what should we do? Should we just rub our balls all over every ghost we find? I say we leave. We might find ourselves with unwanted company if we linger too long. Kurum, he's right. We can figure out the details after we get out of here alive. Alright, we can confirm our current location by tapping map, which is down here. And we can follow the location. Swiping it will enable it to display another location. Touch the center at the right side of the screen to return the map to your character. Okay. So we can do that and boop. Okay. We can switch floors. Center. Cool. Alright, anything interesting in the room? Well, there's a couple of doors. Uh... So this, this is the door we came in, which was a dead end, so we want to go this way anyway. Do we want it to, there we go. Thanks for coming after me, Itsuki. I was so relieved. Alright, uh, anything changes here? Okay, let's check something. Ah, look! Tsubasa has been added to the title screen. So, you can see where this is going. As you uh, grab new characters, uh, they'll be added to the... They'll be laying around on the title screen. So that, that's a fun... Uh, that's fun. I think you can only have three people in your party at a time, though, if I remember 
So you have a, a stock of characters you can use, but... Well, that doesn't sound good. Okay, are we okay, game? <laughs> okay, game seems okay. Alright, gotta take a quick bathroom break. I, I'll be back in just a moment. Test, test. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Lou says, uh-oh, yeah, that, that that had me worried for a moment, too. <laughs> but, you know, I am, um, I am, uh, I did hack my Wii U and am playing a game, a ripped game, a ripped and patched game off of an SD card, so it's not guaranteed to work. Alright, so let's see what we got in here. Okay. Interesting that level ups don't heal you. Got a soft drink. Oh, wait, what is that? No key items. A blob force, but we don't know what this is. It's rare. Wardrobe. So we can change stuff, I guess. Can't change costumes yet. So I guess, so yeah, I think he can get different uh, accessories and stuff. Anyway. Jiggle, 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 jiggle. You can get a good, uh... Pre no, no jiggling on Itsuki here. I've also got a fair amount of information on the screen here. So... The, the major stats are on here. Let's see what else we got. Artists? Which is essentially this screen. So every man, Itsuki, and uh, Chrome. Chrome, they're lords. Okay. okay, 17 year old. DWH 332335. Huh. He hasn't done anything showbiz related in particular. Subasa is happy to keep him updated on the industry, but he himself has no real interest in it. Uh, Tsubasa is 17. Uh, she likes Kyria, the singer, cats and sweets. Dislikes dieting. Even if I fall, I'll fall forward. What's his what's his quote? Uh I'll do my best. <laughs> She participates in one of Millennium Idol Edition. Alright. So that's kind of fun that we get little uh, trading cards. Let's see, what, what is this? Uh, view detailed status on the gamepad. Oh, okay. So, let's see. So I'm looking at my screen, and it's telling me a little bit about the, uh... It drops blob forces in Crawling Darkness. It's encountered in this area, so... That's just telling me a little bit about the, uh, monster. Alright, cool. Let us move on. Uh, a lot of the UI looks a little close to Persona 4 Golden, if you ask me. Eh, there's certainly some similarity, sure. But being that this is a, you know, a Shin Megami Tensei game at heart, it's not too surprising to see a lot of similarities with 
those are Persona. Uh, let's see, we've got... Is this going anywhere? Can I fall off a ledge? No. Sorry, I have to run around to actually draw on the map. <laughs> I didn't get this corner. There we go. Wait, Itsuki. Hello, Jared, by the way. There's an enemy here, too. Uh, the symbol you see before you represents the presence of an en enemy mirage. When you come into contact with the symbol, a battle will begin. You can perform a sword attack with X on these symbols to knock down enemies and avoid combat. In addition, you come into contact with a downed enemy, you may be able to take the first action in battle. In these situations, it's highly recommended that you rely on your sword attack. Okay. Aya! Now, I don't know how different the load time would be if I were playing this off this. Alright, let's see. We've got... what are they? Blobs? Yeah. Jared says, it's not similar, it's the same. <laughs> the start menu is the same. <laughs> Alright, so uh, our personas, or whatever they're called in this game, they actually got uh, new skills, so neat. New skill! I'm learning new ways to fight from Chrome? Chrome, rather? Chrome? So this is why this form exists. Uh, your weapon, or Carnage, has reached a certain mastery level. You will gain mastery each time you act in combat, and when you have enough, you can learn a new skill. Try checking the new skills that you just learned. Okay. So we've got Cleave. And I guess we'll, uh... Put it right there. Is this okay? Mm. Yeah, sure. This is good. Uh, electric lunge, alright. So this is a session skill. There we go. I guess that's fine, thank you. Medicine. Okay. Looks like there's quite a few enemies lurking around here. Keep an eye on your health and heal before things can get out of hand. Uh, we seem to be okay. There's a ghost. Eyes up! Oh, I missed.
Alright. When an enemy's weakness is attacked with a skill, an ally who possesses a session skill corresponding to that skill will perform a follow-up attack. This is called a session. The attacks that make up a session inflict more damage than a single normal attack, so it is crucial that you target an enemy's weakness and connect several sessions together often. The new session skill, Electric Lunge, triggers off of an Elect Affinity skill. In this case, it can perform a session with Itsuki Zio. Try attacking an enemy's weakness with Itsuki Zio. Okay. So, well, skill, Zio. Now we know the blob is weak. This Dark Mage we haven't done yet, but since we know that, you can see the little lightning symbol says weak underneath it. Let's go for it. So we can. Alright, Dark Mage. Now, once you beat an enemy, it fills in the rest of the weaknesses for you, so that's nice. Oops, no, not that one. Okay, so we can... I, I got two medicines. Correct. Got a life stone and unholy temptation. Dun, da, 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 da. Skewer. All right. Light attack. I'll just put that in there. I'll be fine, Jada. Thank you. I guess something showed up behind me. Two revival beads. I wonder what those do. So later in the game, loading out and picking your uh, partners will be very important because of those session attacks. You know, if you have a lightning attack, you want to make sure someone has a lightning-based skill that they'll follow up on. Like this. So we can see that now that we've fought at least one Dark Mage, the rest of the weaknesses and stuff have filled in, so that's helpful. Hey. 
体こいつらは何なんだ<笑>俺だってまだまだ高みを目指せるはずだ Nice little portraits they have of themselves in the background. It's a fun detail. Hey, Trilink. Lancelash, that's going to be another session skill. From Lance skills, okay. I think Encore added like the DLC stuff because there was like a DLC thing, I think. So Encore might have added that. Not 100% on that, though. Sorry, filling in the map. Mysterious powers protecting this wall. There's nothing Itsuki can do right now. Uh. Going up. Uh, that's it. Okay, that's it. Whoop. We've got a phone call. And it's from Toma. Itsuki, are you okay? Yeah, somehow. I found Tsubasa too. We're alright. Where even are you guys right now? I have actually no idea. Oh, pardon me. Ah, oh, you dumbass. Okay, look. You guys gotta find the exit. Got that? There should be a round building somewhere south of you. The exit's near there. Get moving. And be careful. You guys better not die. Huh. He seems to know oh, things. So that must be it. <coughs> ah, it's key. <coughs> Grr. Hopefully it has better load times. I don't, again, I don't know if the load times we're seeing here are representative of the actual game. Again, I, I'm I'm playing a, ver, a ripped version of the game off of an SD card, so... Not terribly sure. Huh, interesting, Itsuki, I think, has had all of the celebration animations for all of our fights so far. Tsubasa has, hasn't. I mean, she's still doing her little celebration animations, but it's all in the background. That's just a random thing, though. It'll focus on her eventually. Monsters keep leaving these behind. What is this? It's called Performa. Chances are it was harvested from a human. Performa? It's a power that only you humans carry within. For beings like us, it provides sustenance and power. That host at the audition was kidnapping people to steal their performa? Wow, look at it sparkle! I sense performa shining within you too, Tsubasa. 
helps us take power that. carried by humans. Which direction over here? Okay, that was the elevator we just came up on. Alright, let's see if I can do this. And attack! There we go. Oh, I'm going to, I that's the manual button. Okay. I was wondering what happened. There. See, lower right corner, X is auto battle. I just hit the wrong button. Okay, we want. Medicine here. There we go. Oh, Soft drink again. What do you mean you're playing a ripped version of the game? Um, to be clear, I own the game. I have it right here. Uh, but this is the uncensored version of the game. So I ripped the game off of the disc that I legally own. And I patched it with the files from the original Japanese version to restore some of the changes that they made for the North American version. Copied it to an SD card then hacked my Wii U to play games off of my SD card. So this is currently running off of... So what we're playing is actually the files from this disc, just with being replaced from files from the Japanese disc, and put on a uh, SD card and played from there. So th that's what I mean. And Lou says apparently they added some stuff to the Switch version, including former DLC. Yeah, I thought it was the DLC. Uh, how's she doing? She's doing alright, but we can we can goose her. Itsuki gets the spotlight again. Ooh, skills. Skills are plenty. Alright, so... Rakukaja raises party's defense. That's fun. And strength boost increases strength by two. Alright. Oh, it's a passive skill. Interesting. Okay. Mm. Well, that's nice. Right. 
And the Felchin skill inheritance is complete. Oh, that's the specific sword I have. Which means... Something. Alright, sword lunge. Session from sword skills. Alright. Yes, that will do. My Wii U copy says Trilink is still sat sealed on my shelf. Ah, I, I know the feeling. You forgot this game was censored? Yeah. It's fairly mild. It doesn't affect the game. What's particularly interesting is that all the censorship is just dumb. Like, Tsubasa's 17, so they're like, you know, maybe she shouldn't be wearing these cleavage shirts and stuff. So they, so they put a shirt on her. And it's like, okay, I can see the train of thought there. But we also changed her age to 18. So you changed her outfit because of her age, but you also changed her age? Why? And why did you erase her vagina bones? Uh, is it skills? I don't know. No. I am. No, no it's not going to be items. Wardrobe, right? Okay, so we've mastered our falchion. Which, I'm not clear what that does yet. Let's see. So she's still working on hers. Uh, that, that will probably become clear later. Because I forget what that does. Chakra drops. Okay, no idea what that is. Let's see. Uh, this button. Fixed EP. Okay, that's that's helpful. So magic points is essentially. Sneaky, sneaky, and attack! Brian says, Rakukaja, Rock play enough SMT games, you learn to translate the spell names. Raku, defense, Kaja, boost. Ah, okay. One nice thing, um, well, I'll show that off a little bit later, but can't show that off yet. If you're gearing up to do a session attack, if a session attack is possible, you'll get a little indicator uh, on the screen, which is a it's a nice little quality of life thing. Casper. Not really. Doesn't seem to give a poop about physical attack. So let's try. Uh, Actually, Tascata heal you. Tascata, see how my There we go. And again, would you please spotlight Sabasa? This is not the Itsuki show.
らんないつき近いぞせいのゴーストがスタンドウィンミンマイアイテムフーストエイキッズ戦いはスタンドウィンテキアーラワルトたたみかけよう So, see, I'm doing my、um, spear skill, and you'll see that the dark mage over in the center right, right of center there, has the exclamation point. That indicates that if I do this, I'll get a session attack, which is nice. Session. <laughs> One of these days it's going to focus on Tsubasa. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. Also, I've played this game before. <laughs> Never finished it though. I. I really like the game. I just got distracted at some point, and at this point, I should probably just restart it, you know, just play it from the beginning. What on earth is that? Okay, well, we've got a bunch of different things. We've got an elevator, a thing, and this big room. I'm gonna guess this is locked. I sense a dangerous presence beyond the door. What should I do? Well, let's not proceed yet. Let's see what everything else is. Chansu. And these,、uh, once you get more further in the game and you get more party members and you get more skills, these battles get really、uh, over the top and fun. Like, they do full on musical performances sometimes. It's really great. How are we doing on EP? We're doing okay. Trilink says, not sure about the US, but in the UK you can do the following things once hitting 16. Have sex. Come here, get pregnant. Yep.、Um, have, if, if it's you know, bio, physically and biologically、uh, physiologically possible for you to get pregnant, of course.、Uh, have a kid. Yep. Get married. I think it depends on the state.、Uh, leave home without parental consent? Not sure. Ride a small moped? Don't know. Buy a lottery ticket? I think that's 21 here.、Um, but you can't play a game with suggestive content or watch an adult film. I mean, here you can, you just in some cases can't purchase one if you're under 16. In the US, you can get a driver's license at 16, but that's it. Yeah, you can get a driver's license. And, oh, so close. But if I, I'm 42, so if I want to see an animated character's vagina bones, by gum, I can do so.
Am I playing this game just as an excuse to repeatedly say vagina bones? Yes. A mysterious power envelops Itsuki's body. Oh, is it free heal? Is that what that is? Itsuki's party was healed. Yay. Well, that's nice. We have to remember, there was also a wall somewhere that we couldn't get through. Called blobs, but they look like top hats to me. I think it's supposed to be a container of goo sitting on a platform with, you know, mechanical platform with legs. All right, did a uh, boss's spear level up? There we go. The good old Tarukaja. Full inheritance, huzzah. I right, raise the party's offense for three rounds. That's helpful. So we can raise offense and defense. This is good. I meant watch films or play or games rated 18 with it all things or suggestive content. Yeah, in the U.S., um, ratings are a guideline. Uh, film and game ratings are a guideline, a suggestion. It's not illegal to play uh, to play such rated games. It's illegal in some cases to sell a uh, like a movie ticket to an X-rated film to someone under 18, but. You can watch it. Well, here's another one of those walls. And we can't do anything right now. Alright. Oh, hey, there's some goodies. So that's what's behind this door, some goodies. Alright, so now that we've seemed to have leveled up our stuff... Top up. And see if we got a boss fight here. Proceed. Hold it right there, Subasa. Ah. It's him, the host from the audition. Shida, you damn traitor, just had to switch sides, huh? I'll show you what happens to turn coats. He Eh? Hey, lad, you someone's master now? I can feel your performa from here. Most importantly, says Lou, in the UK you can drink alcohol in public at 16 even if you can't buy it yet. Hmm. I think... Yeah, I, I think the same thing goes with... Uh, same, same, similar thing with booze. Like... 
you can drink if you're underage, but you can't buy it. You can't sell it to any of the kids. So, if you want to let your kids drink beer, you can. Don't know about in public. No idea. I don't think so. I mean, there's public drunkenness uh, rules, but I, I don't know about drinking in public. Not sure. I don't drink, so never bothered to find out. Careful. This one's different from the other enemies we fought. Keep your guard up. Chrome. Ha ha ha! I found it! Not only Sheeta, but uh, I even got a vessel for Chrome himself. It's not that funny. Er. Itsuki, you okay? Oh, is this Toma? Wait, that's... Toma! Toma! With the Leon Kennedy coat. From Resident Evil 4. I, I, I love the, the, the camera pan around him. Sorry for the holdup. The hero's here and ready to rock. Let's see, drinking age is 21 in the U.S., says Brian, which is honestly a bad idea in practice. It leads to college kids binge drinking when they can get a hold of alcohol. Hmm. Aha, I can finally drink. I'm going to drink all the drinks. Yeah, that's, that's not good. If we didn't have that stigma, it probably wouldn't be as big of a problem. Got the character design. Okay, but that was mistimed sound effects, but okay. Oh, now that's a dynamic entrance. Wait, he's getting to boss our masters now? Certainly looks that way. <laughs> Tee hee. The hell? Perfect. Even more mirages. All you little sheepsies are coming with me. Uh, Lou says, well, in public, as in restaurants. Oh, okay. In private, you can give your kids alcohol from the age of five legally, and earlier, it's probably a bit too young. Yeah, there's... I, I don't know how good, particularly young systems are good at processing alcohol, so... I mean, you also wouldn't give a baby a big chunk of steak, <laughs> you know? <laughs> so... Um, there's probably a decent reason for that. You talk pretty big for a guy in a can. I got a better idea. I'm gonna knock that mirage out of you. Oh, we obtained a play record, whatever that means. Alright. We've got these little fuckers, so let's get rid of those. Actually, maybe we want to up our defense. Hmm. That actually seems like a decent one. Let's try that. Just so we don't get stomped into the ground. Alright, what you got? We got skewer and fire strike. Let's see if the ghosties don't like fire at all. Didn't seem to care that That's 
it's resistant to it, okay. <笑>まだ倒れないのか。一かバチかで。それよ。落ちろ。やった。みんなついてきて。これで。勝てる。勝ち。くらえ。弱点 難しいかも。やった。みんなついてきて。いいの。うひ、まだ倒れねえの。それよ。カインと訓練したんだ。チャンプ始めよう。次。もう一つおまけ。決まった。うわ。翼。おい、ブランス。BT Dubs Andrew, all this uh, SMT talk reminds me I'm planning on requesting you play Persona 5 Royal for my Patreon before this year. Oh god, that's a long, long game. <laughs> Letting you know early in case you want to hunt for a good deal. Okay. I do have some backup picks too in case you really don't want to risk getting sucked into another huge RPG. No, it's, it, it's one I've wanted to try out, so. Uh, how are we doing on health? We're doing alright. セッション。行け。合わせないよ。俺から行く。やった。自信を持て。お前なら勝てる。ああ。くれ。油断するなよ、トム。分かってるって。Well, I had a curiosity. Are you weak to fire at all? Yeah, yeah, you are. But it doesn't prompt a session attack, so who cares? Now the part you've all been waiting for. Yep, everyone's favorite show. It's time to play Find That Mirage. I got something special planned for idiots that get it wrong. Yeah. We're going completely unscripted, folks. So all you idiots better think real hard. Try and find me if you can, of course. If you get it wrong, you won't like what happens next. <laughs> Ichiki seems ill-impressed when he's like, I can't. Is it this one? See, <laughs> Ah. Did I get it right? How the hell do you all know it was me? Lucky guess, which I rarely ever get right. I wonder if there's a tell? Because I just completely guessed. Anyway. Ah, Brian gets the trophy. Well done.
Yeah, we're doing alright. <laughs> Uh, Ryan, I cannot deny that it's long. One of the longest RPGs I've played, eh? I think only Trails of Cold Steel 4 and Final Fantasy 14, if you count that, have been longer. Aren't you dead? No, no, not quite. No, let's uh let's try this. Uh, I don't know. I would have got away with the two if it weren't for you bratty kids. an extra. Alright, poison skewer. Cool. Brian says, let me put it this way, there's a cat in it. You carry the cat around Tokyo in your backpack. That's true, but once you go into the other world, it turns into a talking cartoon cat, which is not as cute, but, you know, I hear the character's fun anyway, so. But, yeah, that, that, that's a selling point. And so, the evil mirage is vanquished by the forces of justice! You made good use of your momentum in that battle, Toma, but your movement was hardly what I'd call efficient. Yeah, I know, I know. But come on, in situations like this, it's all about the showmanship, I mean. Hold on, though. Kane. It's Kane. Uh, this guy's not dead or anything, right? He's supposed to turn back to normal. I mean, that's exactly what he looks like in the game, so... That should be the case, but I have never seen a human possessed by a mirage change so drastically. Trilink's going through withdrawal. Needs that, needs that Nintendo Direct. Alright, let me introduce you guys. This is Kane, my partner. And, uh, Kane, you're looking at Itsuki and Tsubasa. Ah. Itsuki and Tsubasa, then. Toma speaks very highly of you. He says you are interesting friends. Uh, interesting? Itsuki. By the way, Lou, you, you still have a uh, uh, Patreon reward. Uh, probably two now. I have, to, I have to see when your anniversary is. Because we never did one for you last year, and we'll probably have the second one coming up soon. 
Man, Itsuki, you almost gave me a heart attack when I realized you went inside an idolosphere. Idolosphere? Idolosphere? <laughs> Idol. Idolosphere. Pretty good name, huh? This place, the world we're in right now. Look, I was seriously worried about you. Sorry I didn't listen to you, but I couldn't just leave Tsubasa on her own. Who would we eat parfaits with? <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, I know. I kind of figured uh, that's what you were thinking. That's why I told you to get out. Just running off to do something stupid and dangerous without pausing for a second? That was a close one. More importantly, Toma, why didn't you ever tell us you were involved in something this dangerous? Come on, man, this is basic stuff. A hero never reveals their identity, especially to their closest friends. No, oftentimes they do, Toma. 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 To be honest, I didn't want you guys worrying about me, so I figured I should keep quiet about it. Plus, I doubt you'd believe me. Sorry about that, Itsuki. Nah, you don't have to apologize. I guess I understand where you're coming from. Thank you, Itsuki. Thanks, man. But I guess you're a Mirage Master now, too, huh? I don't feel as special. Ah, oh, you have an idea for that? Okay. What's this Mirage Master thing you keep talking about? Cain and um, others like him are called Mirages, and Mirage Masters are the ones who fight alongside them. I see. Kind of expected you to freak out more, to be honest. You're over here acting like this is no big deal. Well, I mean, we've been dealing with this for two hours, so... Am I? Yeah, you're pretty strong, Itsuki. Well, we're gonna hang around and chat. I, for one, would rather not do it in an idolosphere. Let's roll. Transform and roll out. Can I talk to you? In any case, I'm glad you two are okay. Sorry for the bad breaks, Baza. I was so scared. But Itsuki came for me. And he saved you, huh? And now he's gonna buy me parfait. Oh, I guess Itsuki's always going to be Tsubasa's hero. Hero? What's that supposed to mean? Tee hee. Come on, Toma. It's you who wants to become a superhero, right? Yeah, you really don't get it, do you? What did I say? You don't have to worry about it. See this, Kane? Every day with these two. This is the kind of stuff I was talking about. You were correct there, it seems, but for some reason it gives me this sensation of curious nostalgia. Now, I don't know enough about Fire Emblem to know what he could be talking about, so. Whoops. Gamepad's about to run out of juice. There we go. Oh yeah, we wanted to uh, do one of these. And check out the pause screen, see if Toma's there. There he is. Hi, Toma. Now let's play with fire and try saving. There we go, that went much better than last time. Well, we could actually go out the other door. Eventually. 
Go down here and see if we can get in uh, this wall. And go get the goodies on the other side. Nope. Brian says, ah, the good old gamepad and it's two hour battery life. Good times, good times. Yeah. I think the... It, it depends on how much the, the screen is being used. Sometimes it lasts three hours. But one of the big reasons we came back here was just to, you know, top up. Pardon me. We do have a walk animation. Well, there's the door. So we'll just jump off here. We're back at the beginning and and cuts it. So we may have to come back in and explore later to get those walls down. This should let us get back to Daitama. Oh no! no. Surrender your performa! Ah, there's a whole bunch of them! They're after our balls. Crap, that's a lot. Things might get a little rough here. We have to run. We have to fight. We have to run! There's no way we can take on this many. Run where? They've got us surrounded. Don't move! Eh? Honey? Kyria Eleison! That was dumb. Okay, now now that one's pretty obvious as as to which persona uh, Mirage, Mirage Mirage she's using. Kyria. Let's see it, chat. You know who that is. Kyria, why is she here live in person? Why is her underwear sticking out of her pants? Oh my gosh, Kyria is looking at me. Wait, don't tell me Kyria is a Mirage Master too. What do I do? Oh, I can feel my brain pounding. My brain's not supposed to doki doki. Uh, Basa, if it's your brain that's pounding, something might be wrong. <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Oh no, Itsuki, I don't have anything for her to sign. How am I going to get her autograph? Have her sign your vagina bones. Hmm. <laughs> Ellipsis. <laughs> ah, she's gone! Oh, I thought I was finally going to get her autograph. Uh, I think we have more important things to worry about. Come on, let's get out of here while we can. Now, if you're thinking, I bet Kyria joined your party at some point, and she does not have any humongous screen-clearing smart bomb ability. You're right, that's cutscene only. <laughs> we 
we finally made it back. Shame everyone's dead. Yeah, nicely done, you two. Other than, you know, everyone else being dead. Can't believe all that happened. I'm just glad we made it back safe. Now we can have parfait. And say that again. Man, I'm beat. Goodness. I take it the operation was successful, Toma. Uh, always, always nice to introduce a character, but first. Jiggle, jiggle. Your shirt doesn't fit. Yeah, though, um, Kiria had to bail us out at the end there. And these two would be... People who dress in fitting clothing. Oh, they're my friends, Itsuki and Tsubasa. Oh, um, pleasure to meet you. I'm Tsubasa Oribe. It's Itsuki Aoi. That's Maiko. Uh, somewhere in the middle of all that mess, these two got the powers of Mirage Masters. Both masters, huh? So you run a bar? Maybe this is fate then. Sorry, but you are... Someone who's been wearing the same clothes since I was 14. My name is Maiko Shimazaki. I direct others who investigate incidents like this one. I suppose you could call me their leader. Investigation? Yep. Although Mirage related incidents aren't often made public, they're more common than you know. The mass disappearance, I'm sure you're familiar with the name at least. Yeah. That was the incident where a huge number of performers and audience members just vanished, right? Like, all of them, except for Tsubasa. I still think she probably murdered them all and hid their bodies, but uh, I I'm starting to come around on that. Mirages were responsible for that phenomenon, too. We still don't have all the information on what they truly are. But we've confirmed that they reside in areas known as idolospheres and cause harm to humans, hence all the dead bodies. Their existence lies beyond that of our physical realm, so conventional weaponry doesn't really phase them. The only thing I can, that can stop a mirage is the power of another mirage. Brian's out early tonight, not feeling great. Enjoy the rest of the stream. Alright, take care, Brian. Hope you feel better. Like uh, how Chrome and Sheeta helped us out earlier? Sonatori! You catch on quick. Certain mirages can harmonize with talented humans and grant them their powers. Talented humans. Not sure why you've got one, but you know. Using these gifted powers to combat the threat to humanity, that is what it that is what it means to be a Mirage Master. Since we investigate cases involving mirages, we need the help of masters to do it. Unfortunately, those who have the natural ability for it are very rare. How's the pay? Tsubasa fell asleep. Huh? What? I'm awake. Please. I want to help you. Eh? I don't know if I'll be any good at it, but if I do have some rare ability, then I want to help out. Plus, that was a fun dress. I see. You're Aya Haorobe's little sister, aren't you? Huh? How, how, how do you know that? Uh, Tsubasa, your famous whole mass disappearance thing? Yeah, we all know. We all know. 
We've been keeping track of you since that night five years ago. Still, I never dreamed that you'd get yourself involved in all this. During the incident five years ago, you were in the audience and Ayaha Oribe disappeared before your eyes. Yep. And you're thinking if you become a Mirage Master, you might find some clues about your sister, yeah? I've been looking all this time. I only auditioned in the first place because I thought being in the industry would help. If becoming a Mirage Master will help me find her, then I'll do it. I, I want to become a Master of Mirages. I, I guess actually the bar joke only works for um, um, Itsuki because uh, lady patrons of bars are usually mama. So anyway, whoops, what did I touch? Anyway, um, she's thinking about it. Alright, Tsubasa. I'll be counting on your support from now on. Thank you so much. And what about you, Itsuki? I don't know. I didn't hear anything about pay. Uh, well, I suppose it's only natural to be hesitant after all. Dangerous work. But, are you sure you want to let Tsubasa handle all of this on her own? Along with Toma and Kiria and me and whoever else is working? Well, can't really argue with that. All right, you guilted me into it. It's my policy to always get what I want. Well, okay, that's, that's a good policy. Um, Itsuki, come on, man. I understand. I'll join. How's your dental plan? Itsuki-kun. I'll do my best, Miss Shimazaki. No, no, Maiko, yo. itsuki -kun. No, call me Maiko, please. We're on a first name basis around here. More casual. Try again. You're making me feel old with the Shimazaki-san stuff. Okay, I'll do my best. Maiko-san. Okay, he does song here. Maiko-san. Itsuki-kun. Itsuki, are you sure about this? I can't just let you do something dangerous like this on your own, Tsubasa. I have no faith in your ability to not die. The only thing I trust you with is eating parfait. Just having you by my side makes me feel like I can do anything beyond eating parfait. Now let's have parfait. You promised parfait. Oi! Uh, you guys, I'm standing right here. Don't tell me I'm just the third wheel. No, I mean, I'll be counting on you too, Toma. Right after Itsuki and Maiko and Kiri, of course, and probably whoever else works there. Uh, you three are pretty close, aren't you? Yeah, it's a shame you aren't about ten years younger, Miss Maiko. Or you could have gotten in on this. rude. But I mean, what would a 10 years younger Maiko be? 14? Maybe 16? I don't remember what her age is, but I'm pretty sure she's not in her 30s. Oh, Toma. I think you and I need to sit down for a nice long chat about your future. <laughs> Loose is dangerous, huh? So there's hazard pay as well? Nice pension plan? Sorry, my schedule's all full up. Well then, Toma, I'd like you to take Itsuki and Tsubasa to our... Hidden base. You have a hidden base? It's only appropriate for a secret organization to have a secret headquarters, right? Uh, Miss Michael, I, I think base might be stretching it a little. Well, I'm a very busy woman. I have some errands to take care of, so I'll see you later. 
I gotta go stretch out a few more shirts. Bye! I guess I don't really have a choice. Come on, I guess we're going to the hidden base. <laughs> Boo, Aegis, says Lou. Right? And we completed the prologue, so yay on us. Now loading. Save your progress? Why, sure. Yeah, it worked. All right. We are going to take another quick bathroom break. Or, well, I'm going to. You can, you know, do whatever you like. Be back in a minute. All right, I'm back. And Lou says, Maiko's totally based. Oh, Maiko's not just totally based. She's totally hidden based. <laughs> I'm clever. Chapter 1, A Star is Born. That's definitely not referring to Itsuki. Well, it's spacious. Lots of uh, Curia posters. Uh, maybe you want to put something on those shelves. Someone has a drinking problem. And an org organization problem. What's beyond the blue door? Well, here we are. Hidden base. Looks more like an office than some kind of secret base. Well, yeah, it's an office. Ever heard of Fortuna Entertainment? Oh, I know! That's the production company that Kyria belongs to! So we have a budget? Okay. Should have figured you'd know it, Tsubasa, but yeah, this is Fortuna Entertainment Office. Eh? What? Really? Why was I brought to a place like this? Well, what? Mm -hmm. Two plus two. That's Basa. Just a regular production company on the surface, but secretly a team of Mirage specialists and investigators. That's Fortuna Entertainment. No, and I haven't told you guys yet, but this is the production company I've been working with. Why didn't you tell us about it? Yeah, you don't have to worry about telling us where you were. If I knew you were working at the same company as Kyria, I could have asked you to get me an autograph on my vagina bones. That's what you're angry about? Tsubasa, I kept my mouth shut because I knew this is how you'd react. You and that weird vagina bones thing. Just be grateful you have vagina bones to sign. Never mind all that, Toma, so... Where's Kyria? These vagina bones ain't gonna sign themselves. Oh, she's not here. We're not! Well, because she was in the idolosphere. We exited, she did not. Two plus two, Sabasa. Two plus two. Jeez, Sabasa, chill out. Kyrie is pretty busy with work right now. Not only does she have a ton of work, she's got to get ready for that ready for that live performance, too. She's got her schedule worked out down to the minute. Even I haven't seen her in Except for the few minutes ago we saw her. Tsubasa, you okay? <sighs> Deep breaths. I'm just soaking up the same air that Kyria's breathing? What, what are you doing? What are you doing? Right now, I'm... Oh my god. Yeah, I'm breathing the air that Kyria was breathing. Oh, I can die happy. Okay. Well, I mean, at least Kyria's not like... 
her sister or something like that. Not sure what it is about some anime that think incest is really, really funny. Looking at you, Spy X family. Looking at you. Lissai. Oh, right. There was someone I wanted you two to meet. Who's that? Uh, eh, you'll see. They're waiting for you just past the door. Come on, Tsubasa. Back to reality. Wait, I'm not done enjoying the atmosphere yet. <laughs> Leaving. What? Oh, I can leave. How about that? Or, I haven't met the person Toma told me to see. They're behind that blue door. Thank God it's not a green door. Or this would be an AO game. A commercial for the live-action hero show Masquerader Raiga that airs at 8 on Sunday mornings. Incarnation always at the top of the charts. Commercial for the yeah, same thing. There's like a cooking show thing on here at some point, right? <laughs> at least they keep it in the family system. Okay. Oh wait, that was different. Uh, Kira's mega hit, uh, reincarnation. I feel like I hear this playing in the city at least once a day. And we'll hear it at some point. Alright, food and drinks from shops and vending machines will fully restore all HP and EP and cure all status ailments, including unconscious. But how do you get something out of a vending machine when you're unconscious? Probably one of those things like in Dragon Quest where you're <laughs> dragging dead bodies behind you. <laughs> I, I, some of the earlier Dragon Quest games, well actually I think, I think most all of them do this. On the overworld screen, the, the characters that are dead or knocked out are represented by coffins that just kind of follow you around. It's hilarious. Uh, in addition, when cast members consume a food or drink that they enjoy, it temporary, temporarily raises their luck stat. A cast member, can, cast member cannot have multiple luck boosts from food or drink active at the same time. A few drinks to choose from. They each cost 160 yen. And... Alright... Should we get Thirsty? That's pretty great. Veggie Juicy X, High Fiber Vortex, we're not buying anything. Well, we gotta get Thirsty, that's pretty good. Authentically heat aged with a sharpness that lingers quite playfully on the palate, so as not to offend the senses. Itsuki's party was healed. Itsuki's luck became good! Documents are randomly scattered about, making it difficult for someone to find the materials they're looking for. Shells span this wall. It looks like a logical place to display trophies. Play records are logs of things you have accomplished while playing, and awards are given based on completing certain combinations of play records. When you earn an award, its trophy will be added to these shells for all to see. None of these affect the story, they exist merely to track your efforts and look back on fondly as your career blossoms. Wall of Fame, Fortuna Entertainment's Road to Showbiz Glory! Let's admire the trophies. Ah, uh, ah, uh, well, we haven't heard anything yet. And we've, we've got a couple things. But apparently we don't have the right combinations to get actually get a trophy, so... Uh, M MDZ79, censorship is not that huge of an impact in the game, in that game. You mean this game? Uh, correct. Yeah, it's, it's, it's all cosmetic as far as I know. It's just silly. The commercial for the drama Labyrinth of Love supposedly boasts impressive sales for its theme song, Black Rain. Per uh, commercial for the Utaloi Tiki, Bestie Game, a song made using the Tiki program is now on sale. The article reads, 
Exclusive interview with uh, Yatsufusa Hatnaka. Who is this godly visionary? Shelf is packed with CDs by various artists. Whoops. We just did. Uh, the game is... Oh yeah, I, I quite like this game. You know, I'm not playing the uncensored version because it's a... It, you know, change, it makes the game better, it changes the gameplay. It's more because I can, and it's the principle of the thing. Not that chef one, that cooking show one to come up. Dia Witch Iroha. Supposedly it's very popular among mature audiences, along with children. Where's the cooking thing? There we go. Commercial for Microwaving with Mamori, the show where all cooking can be done with a microwave. <laughs> that's a pretty... <laughs> that's, a, that's a really great idea for a show. <laughs> cooking show. It's all microwave food, though. I love that. Alright, let's, let's see what's behind the blue door. It's the Great Deku Tree. That was a mistimed effect, but okay. What is this place? How is a place like this in an office building? Mind blown, right? This place is for Mirage Masters and those with strong performance. Those chosen by uh, Lou says, I've inherited a cooking book with the title The Microwave Gourmet. Nifty. I know how to make caramel corn? But I know an even better, easier way to make it using the microwave. Making caramel is actually kind of a pain in the ass. Um, but I know a pretty good way to do it in the microwave. Uh, this place, there's something uh, about it that feels oddly nostalgic. Yeah, for me as well. I wonder why that is. Where you been all this time? Have you been hiding in my hair, rubber bands? She's been with you since we left the idolosphere. You just couldn't see her, that's all. As long as they're in the Bloom Palace, though, they can go back to these physical forms. Oi! Shiki! Oi! Tiki! Oh, big brother. I mean, it's so awkward because in English, nobody refers to anyone like big brother or big sister. We don't do that. No one says that. I'm not sure. Or big bro. I've heard that one. I've seen it translated that way too. But how else are you are you going to translate that? I, I don't know. A lot, of a lot of times localization, I'll just... She, it would have just said, oh... Toma, you know, um, but if you know enough Japanese, it's it, seeing that conflict is kind of weird to the ear. So, yeah. Anyway, localization's fun. Toma Nisa. Hmm? Huh? Why do I feel as though I've met her before? I can't believe it. I can't believe you're making this little girl call you big brother. Wait a minute. I think I've seen her somewhere before. Yeah, she's the vocaloid or something. 
Eh? It's Tiki, the Altaloid. That's right, the virtual singer, Tiki. A real live Utaloid? Gasp! There's the reaction I was waiting for, and don't accuse me of the creepy stuff. You noticed that first? Look, let me introduce you. The Altaloid you two know is a cover. Tiki's true identity is a mirage. And she looks 14, but go ahead and lust after her because she's actually a thousand years old. She's a dragon, you see. Welcome to the Bloom Palace. I was waiting for you, big brother. Big brother? Wait, me too? Uh, Lou says, I need to find out how my brother is going to react if I call him big brother. My sister actually just re does refer to me as brother. You know, if I call her up, she's like, brother! She'll do, she'll do that. She also calls me ass, too. Because I am one. So, yeah. Hmm. If I'm not supposed to call Toma that, can you be my big brother instead? Uh... Well, um... You're making me very uncomfortable. I can't? I, I guess I don't mind if that's what you want to call me. Yay, thanks, big brother. You might be overdoing it a little. No, thanks for telling me that Tsubasa was in danger back there. I didn't do anything worth thanks. That's all I could really do. I wish I could have gone to help, but all I can do is stay here and pray that everybody comes back safely. Yeah, thoughts and prayers. That's all I got. Meaningful policy? Nah, just thoughts and prayers, really. What do you mean by that? I'm a little different from the others. I'm bound to this place. And this place doesn't move, so... Wait, um... Big Brother, the Chrome and Sheeta still have their memories? They both said they have no idea why they're here. It sounded like they couldn't remember much. I knew it. Wait a minute, Tiki, are you missing your memories too? Yeah, I don't know why, but all Mirages have lost their memories of the past. That must be scary for you. Yeah. Thanks for worrying about me, big brother, but I'm okay. We found Chrome and Sheeta. And you and Tsubasa seem like nice people, so I'm really happy. Huzzah. Uh, Lou says, one would have thought the localizers were aware that Big Brother in English has completely different connotations, and not positive ones. <laughs> yeah, it's, you know, it's on the con- I, I, you know, the context is fine. You, you get what they're going for, so. Aw, Tiki, you're such a sweet girl. I'll be sure to come visit you every day. And love you and squeeze you and call you George. Thanks, Tsubasa. Well, I think that about does it for introductions. Tiki, you want to give them an explanation on the unity? 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 Float still, Tiki. You're kind of bobbing up and down. It's distracting. Oh. You know you have Performa, right? Well, performers, Performa is like the power of the human soul to express itself. We fuse perform per blah, 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 blah. Performa with people and mirages to awaken new power within them. That ritual is called Unity! Awaken new power. Mm, well, I, I guess you could just say it makes you stronger. 
can't really fight like the other Mirage can, but I can perform unity rituals for you here. So, let's perform unity right now, okay? Uh, Tiki, you're making me very uncomfortable again. At least she's not doing that full forward lean right at, you know, you know that thing that anime characters tend to do. Welcome to the Bloom Palace, the miraculous stage where Performa blossoms. Guess what, big brother? You can perform a new unity. That's called Carnage Unity! Alright, Carnage Unity is a ritual of fusing mirages with Performa obtained from enemies to change them into new Carnage. By performing Carnage Unity, more powerful Carnage can be acquired and new skills can be learned from them. I'm pretty sure Carnage is like the weapon. Uh, this is an element that must, that is a must to complete this game, so it's best that you make good use of it. Don't forget to check out the new Unity you can perform. All right, well let's uh, let's do a little Q and A here. All right, what about the basics of Unity, Tiki? What's Tiki? What is Unity? Okay, so Unity is a ritual in which one perf fuses Performa with artists or mirages is called Unity. By performing Unity, Itsuki and his group uh, group's battle power can be strengthened. Actively make use of unity to stand up to more and more powerful enemies. Alright, well, what's Performa? Uh, crystallized various power... The crystallized various powers of expression within the people of this world are called Performa. It will be needed to perform unity. Okay, well, how do I get Performa then? Yeah, basically obtained from battles. When you defeat enemies or pull off sessions, you will acquire the Performa those enemies have. Also, you may gain Performa from your audience in battles. There may be another way of gaining Performa besides battles as well. Keep an eye out as you progress. Well, that's nice. How about a hint? On the Unity screen, you can check details on the Performa needed to perform that Unity. Hints for obtaining them, mainly locations and enemies that have them, will be displayed. Make good use of this when searching for Performa. So essentially, we will get to know what... We need materials to upgrade our stuff, and if we go into the menu, we'll see where we need, where the enemies that we need to farm are sitting, so. All right, well, how about Carnage Unity specifically? What is Carnage Unity? That's a ritual where, where mirages and Performa obtained from enemies are fused to change them into a new Carnage. By performing Carnage Unity, you will acquire a more powerful Carnage and be able to learn new skills from it. This is a crucial element for playing through this game, so actively make use of it. That's nice, but what's Carnage, Tiki? I'm a little unclear on this point. When a Mirage transforms into a weapon, it is called a Carnage. The abilities of Carnage are based on three elements, attack, resistance, and skills. These abilities differ depending on the Carnage, so try using different ones depending on the situation. Well, that's nice. What about these new skills that I can learn? <laughs> Lou says, I keep reading perf uh, Performa as Perfuma, like from She-Ra. <laughs> yeah. uh, to, to learn skills from a Carnage, you need to continually use it. How much you've used is called Mastery. The Mastery gauge fills at the end of every battle, and how much it fills depends on your actions during it. Every magic or physical action taken in battle counts towards that fight's mastery bonus, and at the end of the battle, your cumulative actions are added up into a single bonus to your mastery gauge. Once it reaches a certain amount, you will be able to learn a new skill. Okay, can I power up the skills? If you learn a skill that you already have, that skill will power up. For example, if you have Zeo, which is that lightning skill that uh, Itsuki has, uh, and you learn another Zeo, it will power it up to Zeo plus one. When a skill powers up, there are plenty of benefits, such as an increase in effect and decrease in EP cost. However, some skills, such as passive skills that change the compatibility of affinities, will not power up. Fun stuff. Okay, now that we got the QA out of the way, let's perform a Carnage Unity. Oh, 
Okay, so we'll... Let's check one of the others just... Uh, move the cursor onto the carnage you, uh, you want to learn more about and press Y to see the skills that can be learned from that carnage. Press X to uh, perform an 84. Okay. So we have this mastered falchion, and we have, but you already have this card. So we want to make an iron sword, I guess. And we need blob force, which we have three, we only need one, and own holy temp temptation and one star prestige. So we've got plenty. All right. So our Falchion is attack 16, and this will bring it, uh, our attack up to 26, so that's nice. Alright. Uh, next. So this one will learn Zeo, which will give us a Zeo plus one, which is pretty cool. And we'll learn Dia, which is that healing spell. So some good stuff in our future. Alright. Let's do this. Press the A button to confirm, B button to cancel. Yep, there it is. Okay, so Iron Sword, is this right? I guess so. Yes! Alright, let's perform Unity! So we got the blob thing and some other stuff. So we'll mix them together into a big wall of ghost yarn. The new Carnage Iron Sword has been made! Even if you continue using a Carnage that you've inherited all the skills from, you will gain no new skills from it. If you have a different carnage whose inheritance has yet to be completed, try using that one instead. Do you want to equip the iron sword you just made? I do, Peaky. And we equip the iron sword. Through the effects of carnage unity, the mirage awakens to a new skill. Chrome can now use the special performance Empty Wave. Find more performa. This is all I can really do, but I'm happy as long as I can help you all, even if it's just a little bit. We're more than grateful for the help, Tiki. Great. All right, Tiki, we're all going to go out for parfait. Ah, uh, you know we'd get some for you, but. Uh, you can't leave this place. And it would melt before we got back, so... Yeah, that sucks. I'll make sure to do my best. Got a play record, woo. Oh, hey, Richard. hi. Welcome to the Bloom Palace, the miraculous stage where we're Yeah, 
Same stuff. All right. You're leaving? Okay, bye. Alright, now if I'm remembering correctly, I think the various mirages are just kind of hanging around and we can talk to them. But yeah, there's, there's Kang. <laughs> Suritsuki, Toma seems pleased indeed at the prospect of fighting as your comrade in arms. I will be counting on you to help Toma. To help Toma. Uh, he can be a bit senseless at times, but he has a good heart. Ah. Sure. By the way, Kane, are your memories gone as well? Oh. Yes, I have lost oh. all memories of my time before meeting Toma. And as of now, the return seems unlikely. Oh. I see. <laughs> but I confess, I have gotten quite used to my life alongside Toma and the others. However, that doesn't mean that I have lost my desire to find out who I really am. Oh. Kane. If you need anything, I'll always be happy to help. Arigato. Thank you, Suritsuki. I wonder what he's calling him in the original Japanese. It's probably not... It's probably Dono, you think? Itsuki Dono? That would be my guess. From mm. a strange place indeed. If we can manifest here, this sanctuary must function similarly to the Idolosphere. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Taking form in your world consumes quite a bit of energy. We'll stay here in the meantime. Bearing emergency. Or barring, rather. Than. By the way, Itsuki, you'll be fighting alongside Toma from now on, right? Yeah, to be honest, though, I have almost no idea what I should be doing. In truth, I could say the same. My memories are still all a haze. I know I'm a mirage, but can't even say for sure what a mirage is, let alone who I am. Or what I'm supposed to do now. Chrome. Chrome. Mm. But if I stand by you, something tells me I'll find the answer. So I hope you can put up with me remaining at your side for just a bit longer. Ah. I will always be at your side. When you eat, when you sleep, when you shower, when you poop, I am always there. Always watching. Uh, of course it's alright. Besides, I wouldn't have a chance against the Mirages without you. Here's to a long and prosperous relationship, Rome. Thank you, Itsuki. It will be a privilege to fight at your side. Itsuki. You can usually find us here when things are quiet, but if you ever need us, we'll appear to help you. Where is she? There she is. Cheat up. Konnichiwa. Itsuki, hello. Yeah. So, you can uh, materialize when you're in this room as well, then, huh? Eh? Yeah, it would seem that way. Mitsuki, I'd appreciate it if you would look after Tsubasa. Sometimes I believe she can be a bit, eh, you know, oblivious, perhaps. <laughs> ah, well, you're not wrong. <laughs> and besides, it looked as though Tsubasa trusts you quite a lot. I'm sure she will need your support. Mm. Well, she's been my friend since we were kids. I'll do what I can. Arigato. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. How about it, Tsubasa? First the Fortuna office, and now this big open space inside, my heart's pounding from all these surprises! So, uh, <laughs> The Bloom Palace is a special kind of place, so in here, the mirages can show their actual forms. Surprised? No, because, you know, I've, I've played the game before, so... The only thing that surprises me are the things I don't remember. Hmm? Hmm? Looks like Miss Maiko's back. Yeah, she said there's something she wants to talk to us about, so uh, we'd better head back to the office. You're going already? Sorry. I promise I'll come visit again. Me too. I'll definitely be back soon. And we'll bring, well, not parfait, but, you know, maybe books or a Game Boy or something. Okay, I'll be waiting. Just, just sitting here all by myself. Just staring at the wall. Bye.
no trophies. Hey there. Maiko-san, you're so mean. Why didn't you tell me about the production company before? Well, because I just met you today. Oh, relax. I didn't want to overload you guys. Too much information at once can be a bad thing. Anyway, I just booked a lesson for you, Tsubasa. Lesson? Hmm. That's right. Dancing and voice training. I've decided we're going to debut you as an idol. We're going to exploit the shit out of you. I think we're going to go with the pure and innocent image for you. What? Uh, what? But, but this is all so sudden, I... I... Better get used to it, Tsubasa. This is exactly how Miss Michael likes to run this place. What about the Mirage attacks? A am I gonna be an idol? I have so many questions. Unfortunately, we have no idea when the next attack might be. So, in the meantime, let's start the training. Trust me, you'll make a great idol, Tsubasa. My radar is never wrong about someone's star potential. Uh. You know, if you worked as an idol for Fortuna, it'd probably be a lot easier for you to meet with Kyria. Where do I sign? <laughs> that was quick. Miss Maiko, um, is that a comfortable pose? Just wondering. By the way, you'll be going through singing and dancing training too, Itsuki. Eh? Yes, you. Training as a performer will help your abilities as a mirage master as well, Itsuki-kun. What exactly does that mean? Tsubasa nails the pure and innocent image. Your power as a Mirage Master is dependent on your abilities as a performer. What do you mean as a performer? So innocent. So Some of the earliest records of the performing arts come from dance as a part of religious rituals. The idea was to call the power of the gods into the performer, an invocation of spirits, if you like. Call upon the power of spirits, kind of like a Mirage Master's power. There's a dance in No Theater called uh, Ka uh, where the performer calls a where the performer calls upon a god. It's a little like that. Musical ability, acting, artistry, honing those skills also increases your power of spiritual indication. Basically, if you're a good performer, you'll be strong masters. I'm not running this agency as just an empty front, you know. In any case, I have already booked you two for training. Life is about overcoming challenges, you know. Good luck on your first lesson. Uh, Itsuki, Tsubasa, it's been nice knowing you. I'll make sure to say something real nice at your funerals. Eh. Uh, why exactly are you talking like you're sending us to our deaths? Did you hire Bob Fossey? You'll see when you get to the studio in Shibuya tomorrow. I've ordered the full course, so have fun. That'll be all for today. Dismissed. What do you think, Tsubasa? I'm so nervous. How am I supposed to train? Good luck with the first lesson. The studio's in Shibuya. I'll send you details on topic. It's your first step into the industry. Lessons are the basics for everything, so pay good attention and learn what you can, okay? Alright. 
All right, let's see if anyone new has been added to. Remember, says Lou, uh, you can dance the can-can in a bikini. You are just invoking the ancient spirits. That's right. All right, let's see if, uh, whoops, nope, this button? This button, there we go. Who's laying with us in the grass? Hey, uh, Miss Micah is with us, and so is Tiki. How, let's see how old Miss Maiko is. I'm guessing 26. Uh, where's her age? Oh, it, it's not saying. Okay. Uh, quote, hope you like my idols. She founds the entertainment agency Fortuna Entertainment. She has no skills. <laughs> Miss Maiko has no skills. None whatsoever. And neither does, um, neither does Tiki. Uh, the, the voc the Ultaloid is five years old, version 3.0. Okay, that's the really, that's not how old she is, though. Um, we don't know her measurements. And her quote is, I want to hear everyone's music. Alright, uh, let's see. Uh, we want... She has no skills, none whatsoever. Okay, so, oh, wait, wait here, here we go. Um, Itsuki is an everyman. Spasa is a dreamer. And uh, Shida's a Pegasus Knight. Um, Toma's just an extra. Come on, load in the character. There we go. Uh, she, uh, Maiko's the Fortuna President. And Tiki is a Mirage Ultimate. Okay. Also a thousand years old, yeah. Alright, out we go. Alright, select a location on the Tokyo Axis map will enable you to travel to that location. In addition to pressing A at specific areas and at the edge of the field, you can press X to open the Tokyo Axis map as long as you are outdoors in a city like Shibuya. Okay, so we could go back to the observatory or we could just head out to Shibuya somewhere. I guess let's go to Shibuya. Should I go to Shibuya? Sure. Oh, had some sound skips there again. Oh, and there. I wonder if my SD card is starting to die or something. Because I don't remember this uh, when I played the game years ago. Might try copying it onto a different card and uh, playing from there. Let's see if that does anything. But I don't know if I have a big enough card. I actually have a bunch of 1 gig cards. Uh, but I need more than that. Because, I mean, the, the dump of the game itself is like somewhere between five and seven gigs, I think. Loading. The game is loading. Yes, I'll check my email. Oh, okay, here we go. The day of the lesson. Uh 
Uh-huh. There's the, the Shibuya dog statue thing. There's the building that, uh, I think it's 109 in real life or something like that, but... And there's a lesson. lesson. And here we go. Okay. Tsubasa is uh, texting me. Ah, said Tsubasa. What's wrong? What's wrong? Our first lesson is about to start. I see Tsubasa is nice and nervous. Maiko, how did you get in this chat? The studio I'm having you two visit today is called Uzume Lesson, Uzume lesson Studio. Should be right across the street from the train station. It has a really flashy sign. Can't miss it. Looks like you still have some time. Why don't you check out Shibuya while you're looking for the studio? Tsubasa, this is going to be your first step into the entertainment world. There will be good times and there will be bad times. Just it, but, uh, but just remember, it's all to help you become a star. See you! Uh, various facilities are located here. Items can be purchased at Hiho Mart. Uh, you'll recognize, if you've played the, uh, uh, Shin Megami Tensei games, you'll recognize the character. Uh, accessories that act as armor for Itsuki's allies can be bought at the jewelry place. Other elements can be found there as well, so be sure to fully explore Shibuya. Alright. Uh, so we've got a new contact. I don't know why Tiki is up in the upper left corner with a three. Oh, I guess that means to call her. So, Maiko's profile says, Check out Curia and uh, Mamori Minamoto's great shows. Mamori, I think, is the microwave cook. <laughs> Alright, let's see what... Uh... Tiki, I love to sing. Teach me some new songs you've made. Alright, let's see what, she, what she's about. Hi, says Tiki. Did I surprise you? Toma gave me your contact info. I'll use Topic to help you all out in a lot of ways. Good luck, everyone. Let's see if you can see this. You can do it! Little sticker she puts there. So that's a fun touch. I like that. Alright. Okay, that's just the main map. Uh, do we have a map here? Yeah, we do. Okay. An old train that used to run from Shibuya Station to Sakuragicho Station is on display. Look at that. Hachiko statue. This is the place to meet up with someone in Shibuya. Goes to the map. So that's that. Okay, let's see who who's who's yelling at me. Uh, what do you want, Mikasan? She says, Itsuki, are you nervous about your first lesson? Remember, experience is the key to success. Good luck. And. She has a, her little icon is a picture of a bunny with a martini glass saying, fight on. Let's see if you can see that. Eh, pretty cute. I like those touches, that's fun. Oh, okay, so I'm reading the map. I'm getting the map legend here. So, uh, let me go to the panel there. Okay, side quests, all kinds of stuff. That's the studio. That's the jewelry shop. That's a healing facility. Item shop, more healing facilities, and a cafe. Okay. Just... Oh my god, now what? What do you want, Sabasa? Uh, Sabasa says, 
Found Uzume Lesson Studio. Do you know how long until you get here? Nope. Let's see. Okay, that goes across the street that way. That's where the coffee shop is. Oh, hey. Fashionable girl, I managed to get a ticket for Civ Live. You don't always get chances to see top artists performing live right in front of you. Anyone else non grayed out? Map of the area surrounding Shibuya Station contains information about rail railways and community facilities. Oh, hey, here's some people. Ah, uh, Yashiro, I love you. You're all I need. Oh, if he looks at me, I'm gonna faint. Syria? Hmm? Of course I'm a fan. I mean, isn't everyone? Alright. Okay, I think this is the... Yeah, here's, here's the music, uh, the lesson studio. So that's right there. Chocolate cream flan cake, 450 yen tax included. Nummy nummies. Kyria was a survivor from the incident five years ago, right? I'm surprised she grew up without much trauma. The first reports only mentioned one girl left, but they found Kyria a couple days later. Uh, Chikaomi Tsurugi, the lead, never turned up. Hair dye and cosmetics line the shelves. This back alley somehow feels like a place where mature people hang out. Well, I guess that's why I'm not allowed there. Bummer. Alright. Oh my god, Toma, what do you want? Hang on. I can't imagine life without games. I always get day one copies with the first edition bonuses. All right, so here's the jewelry store. So uh, Lou says, I like how all these faceless, faceless people are walking up right to Itsuki's face when he stands still before they decide to walk around him. These people have no concept of personal space. Yeah. All right, let's see if we can afford any new armor. Welcome to Jewelry Karabia. Uh, Car Welcome to Jewelry Karabia. Karabia, okay. Uh, purchase accessories for the cast. I love how they're referred to as a cast and performers and stuff. I, I love the, the theming in this game is really, really well done. Uh, accessories can be equipped like pieces of armor. Check their shop often because they are invaluable inside a dungeon. Alright. What would you like today? I would like to... Do I have anything I can sell? Ah, so the various, uh... The stuff we have equipped, we can sell later. But Oh, Revival Bead. Revives an ally. Alright. What you got? Okay, we could buy a... Ugh. Ugh. A power bangle or a mage ring. And everyone can equip this stuff. It raises strength. So the power raises strength and raises magic. So. What is. The, what do we have? Let me see what we actually have. What does this stuff do? All right, favorite watch. No added effect. No added effect. No added. Okay, they don't do anything. Okay. Okay. So let's see. Uh, seven hundred seventy-five hundred yen. We only have enough for one. Uh.
Let's uh, let's give uh, Tsubasa a little bit of a uh, power boost. I'm guessing we can't sell the things we have because they were grayed out. Oh, we got some Melmark. Uh, when you make purchases at stores such as Hiho Mart in uh, Karabia, you earn stickers called Melmarks. You can spend your Melmarks to participate in lotteries at places like Hiho Mart. Okay. I'm gonna guess I can't sell the stuff, the accessories I already have, right? Oh, I can. Sweet. No, we're good. Impressive loading here, goodness me. Again, I don't think the actual game loads this slow. I'm guessing it's because I'm running it off an SD card. Two big stars performing at the 106 stage. An event like this happens maybe once in a decade. Of course, I already got tickets. I heard the audition at Daitama got cancelled for some reason. I wonder when they'll start it up again. Few drinks to choose from. 160 yen apiece. Uh, we already have our thirst tea, so. You can tell the quality of a load by its length. <laughs> yep. That has some quality loading right there. Alright. Display of daily necessities on sale. The cheerful voices of staff members can be heard from inside. Oh, hello. Yashiro is Su Surugi? Oh yeah, Mr. Perfect. Nah, I don't like him. I can't deal with that kind of superhuman progeny bastard. Alright, here's Hiho Mart. Let's see how this compares to... <laughs> Lou says I want to guzzle a beauty bomb. I wonder if it's dumping all of Shibuya out of memory and then loading in like the little marts is what's going on. Alright. Oh, well, we got an award here. Alright, that's nice. Yep. 
Rice Ball series made with select ingredients. These feature domestic rice and seaweed. Flan and yogurt line the shelves. Mmm, flan. Uh, Frost's jelly appears to be sold out, though. Wow, son of a bitch. Welcome to Hee Ho Mart. With its instantly recognizable mascot, Hee Ho, Hee Ho Mart is a convenience store that sells everyday consumable goods. Uh, the store also has a unique service where it will buy back goods from its customers, even if you opened it or ate it. You should make use of the store to prepare before going exploring as well to get rid of unwanted items. How can I help you? Ah, soft drink. Uh, we've got one. We've got an energy. No energy drinks. Ice bag. Restores a fixed amount of HP to the party. Oh, that's nice. Cleansing Oolong cures poison. Might be worth having one of those. My daddy. Fresh spicy curry revives an ally. Well, we already have two reviving beads, so that's fine. This is a light attack. And we can just buy an attack. Oh, sure. Let's, let's see. So we can use an item as an attack. Let's, we'll give that a try, sure. And then, uh, let's pick up two more soft drinks, why not? Thanks for buying stuff. Here's a token of our appreciation. We got a Melmark. That gives us four. So is that enough to play the lottery? One try per Melmark. Try as often as you like. You've got four of them. What are the prizes? Alright. Uh, strength increase, skill increase. So, so special prizes are various stat increases. Uh, fresh spicy curry, energy drink, dart, ice. So we can win items or stat increases. So that's fine. Alright. Let's give it a try. We drew a lottery ticket. We won fresh spicy curry! First prize! Whee! Sure. Let's draw another lot. Third prize, ice pack. That's the, I think, heal everybody a little bit. Got a soft drink. Alright. And another ice pack. Nifty. Try again when you have more mill marks. Whoops, that's not the button I wanted. Revi that's a revive, okay. So that's pretty cool. Please come again. Well, let's uh, browse Twitter or read email or something while we're waiting for Shibuya to load. Alright, what terrible, depressing things are happening in the world right now? Ah, yep. Hmm, well that's not good. Well, that's, that's, that's depressing. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, I can have less faith in humanity. How about that? Ah, here we go. The famous Sanzenin Pharmacy. It's full of supplements and medical goods. 
Various magazines line the racks. Okay, more, uh, more drinks. Pumpkin spice soup, strawberry mochi, and another veggie juicy X. What about this one? Uh, macho mocha, that, <laughs> I like that. Thirst tea, uh, Amrita shower. Macho mocha is pretty good though, we'll have to try that at some point. That's the other alternate exit for the pharmacy, I guess. Oh, the vulgar man says, this is Shibuya's central street, the most flourishing street of them all. Don't know what's so vulgar about him, but okay. Alright, where's our coffee shop? I think I just passed it. Tsubasa, what are you doing here? You're supposed to be over on the other side. Konnichiwa. This cafe's lattes are so good, but a mocha frappe is amazing during the summer. That woman loves her cafes. All right, let's let's go talk to Tsubasa here. Wait. Oh wait, so someone contacted us earlier, right? Yeah, Tomo wanted something. It's almost time for your first lesson, huh? I've got work. I've got work. So good luck, I guess. Try not to lay down and cry. Thanks, thanks, Tomo. Konnichiwa. Oh no, it's not. Uh, that's that's not um. Uh, Tsubasa. It's just someone dressed exactly like her. I guess that's a school uniform or something. Um, Kiri is so cool and popular too, but that Udaloid's pretty popular too. Even if she's not real, she's got a great singing voice. Jordium Z, hello. Can tell by the load times this is the Wii U version. It is. It's also a uh, hacked version uh, running off of an SD card, so that's probably not helping. Uh, I'm, I'm playing the... Uh, the patched version of the game that restores the the edited content for the North America version. Yeah, basically just some dialogue and uh, 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 costume changes. You know, small alterations, doesn't affect gameplay, but... This character is too young to be bearing so much cleavage. Well, okay, what are your solutions? Well, we could cover up her cleavage or make her older. All right, so what did you decide on? Both! All right. Welcome. Hmm, what should I get? Well, let's see what the drink menu is. Each drink is 400 yen! Oh, God. Honey Cafe a lot. A lot of Honey Cafe. Romansco Smoothie. That sounds good. Let's change menus here. Peach... Etol Tart? Don't know. Uh, forest Berry Jam Witch. That sounds fun. Vegetable Bean Baguette. That sounds terrible, honestly. Alright. Uh, Lou says, presumably Macho Mocha contains less chocolate and more espresso and definitely comes without cream. <laughs> Lou says, why not both meme? Yeah. Alright, another quick bathroom break while uh, Shibuya loads again. Be right back. Okay, well, I timed that really well. I uh, sat right back down the minute it, we came back into town. Let's see. Jordium says uh, they censored a wedding suit that shows less skin than, Peach was w than Peach's wedding dress in Mario Odyssey. I'd love to see what they were thinking when translating the game. Yeah, a lot of the choices don't make any sense. Like, there's, there's one bit, uh, there's one costume of Tsubasa's that is... Uh, you know, that bears cleavage, so they covered up her cleavage because she's 17. Okay, but you aged her up to 18. And she's still in a bikini in several parts of the game, so... Huh? <laughs> yeah, it's just weird choices. Alright, here we go.
you know, Kyria, they, they changed her performing, her performance undies to pants, which, okay. I mean, her, her outfit is ridiculous, so, you know, but anyway. Now, that's not what I was wearing outside. <laughs> Heavy set man. Uh, are you our, uh, training instructor? Shut up! Silence! I'm still doing my signature pose. Etoile? Star in French. Okay, thank you. Signature pose? Here it comes. In a world of terrible singing, only one man can make it sound good again. Barry Goodman has arrived. Or, you arrived to where Barry Goodman is. Um, Tsubasa Oribe, sir, pleasure to work with you. Okay, Tsubasa, got it. You can call me Barry. Okay, Barry. Wait, Barry Goodman? Or body good to man. Uh, someone you know? Yeah, his, his anime t-shirt's pretty, pretty swank. Maybe, I remember if Barry Goodman was one of the guitarists at Kyria's live concert a few years back. Apparently, he was a guitarist for a famous American rock band, and his solo album sold millions. What are you doing here? But that Barry Goodman was a lot more... Athletic looking than him, so it's probably a different person. <laughs> Afraid not, Sibasa, you rude little shit. You're looking at him. What? How much weight exactly did you put on? I, I don't know, like, you know, 25 pounds maybe? I mean, come on, the guy's. The guy's solidly built, but Jesus, woman. Don't be so mean. Tsubasa, you're being really rude! <laughs> Barry Goodman is a very good man. <laughs> oh, I'm I'm so sorry for being horribly insensitive and rude. Ah, don't worry about it. The little lady's got a point. Barry Goodman's just a merry fat man. Japan, do you... That's not fat. Yeah, that's all in the past now. Lou applauds the terrible pun, as do I. Alright, kid, you're up next. Name, please. Wait, wait, did he in English say name and race? Oh, name, please. That's what he said. Okay. I'm Itsuki Aoi. Nice to meet you. Maiko told me to give lessons to some rookies, and anyone who enters this studio starts out a rookie. Even me. At the beginning of the day, I start out a rookie. I'll try my best. Good answer. I'm pretty in the zone today. All right. We'll train three times faster and tougher than normal. It's a big Jordy. It's just water weight. Yeah, I'm certainly not getting a water weight today. I... I, my body, for some reason, today is not absorbing water. Everything I drink is just passing straight through me. It's so weird. Hence the more than normal bathroom breaks. More info than you really needed, but... Hey. We're all close here. We're all comfortable with each other. Three times normal. Do, do we really have to? What? You don't know? Today's the release date for a figure from the best anime ever, Dio Witch Iroha. And they've only got a couple limited editions that come with a special bonus. Ah, I gotta get there on time. Oh, Taku. Okay. What? You got something to say? I'm not allowed to be a fanboy, huh? I didn't say anything. 
But I can't buy the limited edition, my life is over! So I need you guys to cooperate and finish this quick! If we don't make it out in time, Mitsuki, I'll just make you get in line with me. And I got it! Triple speed's fine by me! Maiko asked me to give you the full boot camp experience, honestly, though. I'd say triple speed still isn't enough. Alright, you better prepare yourselves, rookies! Barry's lesson begins. Mm -hmm. So she's singing, he's yelling at her, and our job is to just kind of stand around awkwardly and watch. Okay. How many times do I have to tell you? I can't feel an ounce of your soul in your singing. Yeah. If you're gonna howl and wail, get in the alley with the dogs. Wow. I want you to smother me with your shiny balls. Your shiny balls of soul. Your, per your performa. I don't know what you were thinking about. Listen, Tsubasa, my training can help your voice, but you think you're going to move anyone singing like that? No. Because that's what I'm hearing. Keep singing like that, and there will be no point putting you on a stage. You're an entertainer now, Tsubasa. A professional. People are going to pay big money to see you perform. You need to understand what it means to be a professional. If you can't do that, quit now and get out of showbiz. And forget about Kiria ever signing your vagina bones. I can't do that. I need to find my sister. I have to... Oh yeah, we forgot about her. I don't give a damn about your reasons. All you're doing right now is singing for yourself. I can't feel any message you're trying to put into it. For myself? Then how do I put a message within my song? I mean, I can't just give you the answer. You gotta figure that out. You gotta feel it within you. Communicate the secrets of life as you chortle baby shark. And you, Itsuki, don't just brush this off as Tsubasa's problem. I'm, talk I'm talking to you too. Uh. Don't overthink it. You gotta ask your heart. Alright, one more try. Hi! Baby shark do 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 baby shark! Stop! Stop! Stop. This is a waste of time. Could have been doing something actually productive, like watching anime. If you want me to teach you anything else, you better go study up on your Dia Witch Iroha. Well, we got our money's worth, I'm sure. Sorry, Itsuki. Probably my fault Barry got mad and left. I guess maybe I shouldn't have, uh, you know, harped on the weight of someone I don't know. Repeatedly. That was kind of mean. In retrospect, I'm regretting that. Don't worry about it. I'm sure I made a lot of mistakes, too. Standing around watching you. You just ended up taking most of his criticism. I guess it's tough being an idol, huh? All this has got me thinking. About working as an idol? About Aya? About Ayaha? 
<laughs> yeah. I didn't expect you to guess that so easily. Just had a feeling. Just hit me hard, realizing what a tough world my sister was living in. All the training and work as an idol may have been really difficult, but she never even showed a hint of that. Of course, you know, she always went straight to her room when she came home and crashed, so... You know, I don't think I ever saw her awake except when she was on stage, so... Never really had time to complain. She was always so kind whenever she was back home. And she was so cool and brilliant whenever she was on TV. I'm probably just not cut out to be an idol like her. Well, I think you're pretty entertaining. I'm sure you'd make a great idol. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to take that as a compliment. But thanks for trying to cheer me up. I guess you really never change, huh? I'll give it some more thought on my own. See you later. And she just fades out of existence. Oh. No. Oh. Oh. Oh, Kyria. Hello. Hey. Did you manage to tuck your underwear into your skirt? Hello. Uh, um. Yes. Well, uh, thanks for rescuing us at Daitama. No worry about it. But I just walked past your friend. Is she okay? She looked pretty depressed about something. So did your collar close with a belt? That's... That's interesting. I don't think I have ever seen a jacket that does that. Um, I'm also wondering about the, the, the fastener across her chest. I'm like, is that a... Is it a snap on one side? Oh, it's it, there's three of them going down her front. I, I guess there's... It's just one side is a snap and the other is a uh, rivet. Hmm. Anyway. We just had a lesson with Barry and we just ended up making him mad. We, we did harp on his weight. Well, Tsubasa did. She's, she's kind of a jackass, but you know. Mm -hmm. Hmm? Well, getting mad is basically Barry's job. So, you gotta stand there and listen to her sing, right? What'd you think? Hmm. Eh, I thought she was really good. I don't think she really deserved that much criticism. Huh. So I see. Hey. You two really want to be singers? Me? No. Well, I don't know if I'd go that far myself, but I, I guess so. Really? A singer has to use their song as their words. Huh? Huh? It's like in Baby Shark. As a singer, she's still a newborn baby, hasn't learned how to use her words, you know? But a baby still has emotions. That's why they cry, right? Still have to express their feelings somehow. I guess so. So she should have sung as though she was crying. Okay. Barry would never miss that message. So, you're saying I should get Tsubasa to cry before training starts? No! No, you dumbass! No! Kyria silently hands you something. Got a ticket. Oh, well that, that was very quick on the screen. That probably should have been on there a little bit longer. Here, take these. Are you asking me out? Deto. Just like Baby Shark. Yeah, it makes you cry. Oh, that's a good expression. 
Tickets to my live concert. Live? Concert? You should come watch it with her. It's up to her what she takes away from it, but I'm sure that she'll... Something. Hmm? Yeah. Well, never mind. Yeah, sure, Su Tsurugi is my co-star. He's a top-class artist. I'm sure his performing skills can inspire you to be a better master. I haven't heard kind things about Yashiro. Well, I have to get to practice. Johnny. Shark do 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 baby shark do 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 Oh my gosh, someone's calling me. Alright, let's see. Who is it? It's, uh... It's Tsubasa. Sorry I left without you today. But I saw a fat person outside and I thought I'd better go tell them that. <laughs> They're fat. Something... Something that fat people don't know. And it's my job to let them know. Uh, I was feeling a little down earlier, but I still plan on trying my best. Well, hey, I've got a surprise. Uh, we can say glad to hear it, or I've got a surprise for you. So I'll say, I've got a surprise for you. A surprise? I actually got tickets direct from Kyria for her concert. Are you serious right now? Super serious. Do you want to go watch it with me? It's this joint concert thing called the Civ Live or something. Civ Live? The one at the 106? Yeah, that's the one. Oh my god, I can't believe this! It's in all caps, so... And she sent me a picture of a dog with hearts. Wait, so if I hadn't gone home, I would have been able to get the tickets directly from Kyria herself? Ah! I'm so stupid! Baka baka baka! I should have just gone- I shouldn't have gone home! And at least you get to go to the concert, right? But I feel like I totally missed out. Well, think of all the fat people you got to inform of their fatness. I'm glad you're back to normal. I'll give you your ticket on the day of the concert in front of the lesson studio. Thank you! Alright. And fade to black. And our casual clothes have been added as a costume. Yay! So has uh, Tsubasa's. You can now change your cast member's costume. A cast member's costume can be worn by going to wardrobe in the menu. Changing the costume enables you to view your cast members fighting in different outfits. Costumes do not affect your cast member's performance in battle, so go ahead and choose your favorites. And so, the day of the concert. Hey, she was just showing them the way to the nearest parfait. <laughs> there you go. We still haven't had our parfait. I am salty over my lack of parfait.
Yep, alright, now who's contacting us? That's Toma. Oh, by the way, uh, Itsuki, you see that scroll bar on the far right of the topic screen? Uh, yeah. If you press the very bottom of it, you can just skip ahead to the most recent messages. Wonders of modern technology, right? Don't skip over any of my messages, though. Wait, crap! Totally forgot to get the ticket. What shall I do? Kiri and Yasha are on the same stage together, isn't it? Just amazing! Were we meeting at the lesson studio? Is that where we were going? I think so. Oh, hello. Kyria was a survivor for the- oh, uh, yeah, you said that. Oh, here you are. Hello. Uh, hi, Itsuki. Hi, Itsuki. Uh, the concert's about to start. Then let's go! Alright, let's cert this con! Oh, I'm almost here. Wow, everyone's- Really excited. Hey, you think some evil purple mist is gonna show up and all of these faceless people are gonna drop dead and we're gonna have to fight a big monster or something? You know, maybe. We'll see. That's how these things go a lot. It's a live concert featuring both Kiria and Yashiro Tsurugi. Of course they're excited. Right, Kiria mentioned him. Is he really that amazing? A live concert this big? Yatsufusa Haranaka is probably the only guy who could set up something like this. Yahoo? Whoa! Of course, I'd be the idiot in the car over there going... Honk, honk, come on, get out of the way, get out of the street. We need to get to work. Guys, it's about to start. She was wearing underwear originally, or maybe that was the, the the thing that they changed. Either that, or I I'm I'm, I'm playing the dump instead of the patched dump, <laughs> which might be the case. I don't know. Very short song, but you know, it, it is a video game, so. And it stopped raining, so that's nice. <laughs> Kiri is so amazing, she's so cool! Whoa, I can see why you were recommending her all the time. See? Just by singing, just by standing on stage, Kyria can give people energy. Yay, Kyria. Kyria lays on. Tsubasa? Are, are you breathing in her essence again, Tsubasa? 
That's the, yeah, I thought it was a sensor outfit, which means that I probably copied the the uh, the full dump of the game onto the SD card instead of the uh, the patched version, like an idiot. So, oops. Are you okay? I I want my singing to give people that energy too. I want to be able to shine on stage just like Kiria. At least they took the time to redraw the pants rather uh, to draw pants rather than just, you know, painting her legs purple. I've made up my mind. I'm gonna do it, Itsuki. Itsuki, brother. Uh, so never mind all that stuff I said before. Before? When I said I wasn't cut out to be an idol like my sister. Just watch. I'm going to be an idol, no matter what it takes. I may not be as good as Kiria, but I promise I'll sing so I can give people energy and make my fans happy. Ah, sure. I know you can. I'll be right behind you. Just kind of watching. I don't know what else I can do, but I promise I'll do anything I can to help. If you're cheering for me, I feel like I can do anything. I mean, at least I didn't try to stream this video with it set to private this time, so, that, so that's good. Oh, uh, your performance showing. My boobs, they're huge! Tsubasa Oribe's soul as an entertainer has, a entertainer has achieved a new awakening. Tsubasa's inspiration has taken form as a as new performer, Wings of Song. Okay. What is this? A anyone seeing this? Why is my chest all sparkly? It, it came from within me. Performer is shining before Tsubasa's eyes. Looks like you might managed to find the answer all on your own, Tsubasa. Maiko. Maiko. What you're feeling right now is the message Kiria wanted to convey through her performance. It's no baby shark. But... And that performer is proof that you found the inspiration for your own answers, Vasa. You just opened up a door within you to a new gift. A gift? Now then, next up would be Yashiro's gasp!
So what's interesting is... Hang on a second. So what's interesting is um, some of the uh, the censorship reversions are actually in here. For instance, uh, Tsubasa's age was changed back from 18 to 17, which is what it is in the original. So we saw that in her profile that her age is 17. So some of the patch is in there, but for some reason that pre-rendered movie is the, it's the original one rather than the uh, uh, the different one, which is weird. So I might have I might have just missed a file when I was uh, 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 installing the patch or something. So who knows? Oh, well, doesn't matter. What? What is that? Now loading evil attackers. Please stand by. Yeah. Whoa. Is everyone else not seeing this? Yeah? I feel so tired. Ugh. Everything's just a huge pain. Why does everything seem so pointless? Is this some kind of mirage attack? But I've never seen anything like this. Oh, pardon me. So I didn't just... I'm not just running the dump of the game. I am running... A partially patched version, so that I'm not sure how I managed that. Oops. You won't escape. Now there she goes. I said you won't escape! So even the real-time costume was the, the edited version. Interesting. Oh, what? You! Out of my way. Fear my mysteriousness. I sense an immense amount of performer within her. Avoid killing her if you can. I want her alive. You, you, that, that eye patch and the stupid tail, you, you can leave that. But the rest of her are good. Uh, and I better not bend forward or I'll stab myself in the abdomen. Hold it! And I thought I said, get out of my way! Itsuki, Toma! Huh? Aya? My sister. Oh no. Interesting, she says Nechan. Uh, in the dialogue so far, she's never referred to her sister as Aya. It's always been Ayaha, so interesting choice. Not incorrect, it's kind of an odd choice. Kyria! Uh, oh no, my idol's dead. What do you think you're doing? We're in the middle of a battlefield. Oh, this is a battlefield? I thought love was a battlefield. No, Kyria, because of me, she... Oh, my head. I must 
continue my mission and return to the idolosphere. Wait, Ayaha, wait! She has a tail. Yeah. Kyria. Kyria. I'm sorry. It's all my fault. I'm so sorry. Damn it, she's hurt pretty bad. This doesn't look good. We need to fall back and regroup. You have to go after her. Something is about to happen here. If we stop now, who knows what could happen to Shibuya? For the world! But how are we supposed to fight against that many enemies? I, I can't fight my sister! Stop making excuses, Huts. For five years you were looking for her, right? But you didn't have any clues, and no power to save her. Well, now you do. Well, there we go, but now you do, so you have to go after her, no matter what. You know, talk to her about the power of love or something, you know. Sing her baby shark, but communicate the power of love and family through the song, you know? You're all Mirage Masters now, like it or not, we're already involved in this. Of course, you're all level 5, so. It's not ideal. There's no point just running from your fate when it's when it's given you a chance like this. Say hi to Ayaha for me, all right? Tell her to hurry up and come. No, I must blame. Don't worry. I'll take care of her, because I ain't going in there. The rest is up to you. Be careful, everyone. Don't worry, Miss Maiko, we got this. this. looks like the perfect time for a heroic comeback! We're the only ones that can do this. It's alright, Tsubasa. We've got your back. Okay. Let's go! Oh heavens! After the game loads. No. Oh. And her casual clothes have been added. That's nice. Oh, hey, let's talk to this person. Hi. Why am I so tired? I need to save my sister as soon as possible. Please, Ski, help me. <laughs> Idol? Who cares about those? What does that even mean? Where are we going? We are... Oh, it's, it's right up here up the ramp. Okay. Can we even cross the street? We can. Yeah, how about that? To the idolosphere. Let's go. And now we'll load. <sighs> yeah. There are switches that lift this, that made outfit's arm, so you have to go up the sleeve and do another level, so... That's the gimmick of this one.
So this is... Aya, where are you? Iski, make sure you keep an eye on Tsubasa. We just can't trust her by herself. She's liable to step on a rake or something. Got it. So I'm gonna need your strength again. And you will have it! <sighs> Alright, Kane, let's get this show on the road. Well said, let us storm the field with speed beyond speed. Sight beyond sight. That's a Thundercats thing. Sword of Omens, that's what it is. Right, well, there's the door. What is this? Thing? What is this? That's a warp point. Warp portal. Will appear within a dungeon. Activating multiple warp portals will enable you to teleport to different locations. Uh, can't uh, teleport to warp portals located in other dungeons. Warp portals will aid you in completing a dungeon, so it's best to activate them whenever you find them. Okay. No other, uh... Oh, it's nice is we can see that we got the new sword, and it's actually shown on screen as a new sword, so well, that's nice. Can't do anything with this right now. Whoop, that was the wrong button. Oh, hey, and there's Barry. He's with us now. Taking a nap. <laughs> Scratch. Scratch. There we go. Oh, the yawns are hitting me. Attack of the yawns. Alright, special performances can now be used. Special performances are skills that use the SP gauge located in the upper right of the screen. I see it. Uh, special performances can trigger sessions while ignoring affinities, and many have powerful effects unlike any other skills. The SP gauge will fill as you perform actions or connect sessions during a battle. Okay. Oh, damn ghosts. Hello, Nightmare Clown. Yeah, he's like, I want none of that, thank you. Nickel wise, instead of penny wise, nickel wise, get it. Ha ha ha. It bit me. When you're afflicted, afflicted with a stat, with <coughs> status element poison, you will incur <coughs> damage at the start of a character's turn. Uh, Nickel Weiss must be the upmarket version. There you go. Additionally, if an ally remains um, afflicted with poison, he or she will continue to incur damage following the battle with every step taken on the field. Uh, so it's best to treat him or her with an item or a skill as soon as possible. There we go.
Okay, so we got another Zeo, so we're going to Zeo plus one. Which increases its power. It still costs the same, but that's alright. This is good. Alright, Sword Blaze. Uh, sessions with Sword Skill. Alright. All right, HP and EP can be healed with items or skills as well as being used as well as by using facilities located in the city, such as the cafe and vending machines. If you feel the investigation of a dungeon has become too much, it's best not to push yourself any further and return to the city. Alrighty. What do we got here? So we've got a new thing from... who is it? Oh, Tiki is talking to us, as you can see in the upper left. There we go. Alright. I have a message from Kyria. You have to chase after Ayaha. Um, Oribe? She's in the Idolosphere. Uh, Maiko took Kyria to the hospital. You don't need to worry. That was the message from Maiko. Okay, and... Who the hell is this? Oh, it's Tiki again. I've installed a really useful new add-on to your topic, big brother. It's a feature called Unity Note. Whenever there's a Unity available, the Unity Note will send you a notification. Subasa's Carnage, uh, Subasa's Carnage ready for Unity. Wicked Lance. Oh, neat. Well, I mean, since we're standing right by the door, let's, let's go get it. Okay, what does Toma want? Kind of worried about Tsubasa. Hope she's not too hung up about it. No, I'm sure she's fine. Uh, map. And we want to go... Nope. That's where we're going. Like how people have performance, cities do too. That's basically what the Idolosphere is. The true form of the city. So the bad guys are trying to rob the town's performance straight from the Idolosphere itself! This time, it's not just about beating the enemy, huh? We'd better give it all we've got for Tsubasa's sake, too. She's probably at the hospital. Looks like we got something. Alright, best debut performance. Acquired 5% of play records. Huzzah! 
We got a trophy. Standing right by the door has no impact on loading times. So. where the entertainment power of a performing artist of performing artists and performer if used to create radiant skills radiant skills are different from normal skills and are useful since they since they use no skill slots and are effective by just being equipped some skills are necessary for are necessary for story progression so actively make use of them Don't forget to check out the new unity form Make new carnage now. Uh -huh. Wicked lands. Right. Can't wait to see what it'll be like. All right. Do we have new? Yes. Let's. Well, let's do the first one first. Carnage unity. So we can get the wicked lands. Which lets us hit things harder. And there it is. Wicked. Let's go. You want to equip it? By gum, I do. Through the effects of Carnage Unity, the Mirage awakens to a new skill. Special Performance Aerial Dance. Yay. Alright. Whoops. Nope. All right, Radiant Unity, let's see. What's Radiant Unity? All right, Ritual, uh, Radiant Skills, requires Performa born from each of the gas. All right. What are Radiant Skills? Uh, different from normal skills, exceptionally useful since they use no skill slots and are effective by simply being equipped. Some skills necessary for... Okay, so same thing. Great. Alright, so... Uh-huh. Let's perform a Radiant Unity now. Can we not? Oh, it's just... We're, oh, we're unlocking the option, we just can't do it yet. be back.
Alright, back inside. Overkill! Since the enemy's remaining HP decreased to zero during a session, an overkill occurred. When an overkill is active, the remaining attacks in that session will ignore the enemy's resist null repel drain. Uh, okay. But it's already dead, so I'm not sure how that's useful. Casper Force. Whoop, didn't quite fill in the map here. Aha! Uh -huh. Here. 
きましょう轟けこれだな私から行くねこれでお前の技を見せてくれああ期待してなそれよ行かせしゃってまずは俺に頼んだ任せていいわねシーダ私に力を貸して任せてどうだこれ 
No idea what that means. Oh. Okay. You don't see the Yeah, run. Alright, so we are in the top level on the right, so any of these would actually be fine. So we can go to the second level there or the third level over there, but let's explore. Up here first. Yeah. Oh, look how happy everyone is. Oh, I, I didn't see that, Lou. I'll have to look for that. Oh, ironclad. Stage rank. So Itsuki's soul as an entertainer has achieved a new awakening. Itsuki's inspiration has taken form as new performer leader's gaze. All right, a cast member stage rank signifies his or her rank as an entertainer. It will increase the more he or she participates in combat, including performing longer session chains. As their rank increases, they will receive various benefits such as new performer being born from within them, some may grant them even greater power. And she's stage ranked too. Comforts of home, okay. And a regular level up. New topic. What's going on? Alright, Tiki, what do you want? Itsuki's radiant skill ready uh, uh, radiant skill ready for unity. Director Itsuki. Tsubasa's radiant skill ready for unity. Traport. Traport? I don't know. Okay. Chakra drops. We got some clothes here. And another one of those things. Love fed fat soon turns to boredom. Huh. Okay. Uh, a little bit. Wow. 
So happy. Itsuki apparently gets the heal spell, that's nice. Always good to have. But you can see that we only have so many skill slots here, so at some point we're going to have to replace one of these. So you can see where this is going. You have to pick and choose which one's... Uh, that's why they ask you, is this okay? So as you get further into the game, you have to start considering each character's loadout and how they synergize with other characters' loadouts so you can do session attacks and stuff. It's a really nice uh, battle system they have in this game. Unfortunately, we're not going to get into any... We're probably not going to... Yeah, we're definitely not going to get into any of the actual uh, performances stuff, which is a shame because those are really fun. But we're going to go back and visit Tiki and because we've apparently got a couple of Radiance Unity things to do. So we'll go check that out real quick. Stretch. Yep. Uh, stretch. Lisa says, I cannot describe how much that stray hair in Sabasa's face would irritate me in battle. Yeah. Another topic from Tiki. Another Tiki topic. Uh, you should come to the Bloom Palace once you've collected Performa. You might be able to perform new Unity. Well, I, we're, we are on our way, kiddo.
Welcome to the Bloom Palace, where palaces bloom. Alright. Director Itsuki, when you perform a session overkill, the target will switch instantly and attacks will ignore affinities. Oh, that that's that's what we're uh that's that's what it does. So if you smack an enemy and kill him, and he has zero HP, instead of the subsequent session attacks uh, beating on a dead horse, it will automatically switch to a different enemy and start beating on them instead, ignoring affinities. Okay, that's pretty cool. Let's perform Unity! Ah, there we go. Lady Anto, <laughs> Strike pose, Vogue. Brofist! We have realized the new Radiance Gold Director Itsuki. Huzzah. Alright, well, okay, we missed this top one, but we've got this one here. Uh, Traport returns you to the Fortuna office from inside the Idolosphere in an instant. Well, that's, that's, that's pretty helpful, actually. Cool. Let's do it. Humanity is performing unity with their V-bones for a long time. Yeah. Pull my finger. We have learned a new radiant skill. Toma did not learn anything. Yes, yes, Oni-san, I know. And that's the wrong button. It's this button. There we go. Alright, it's 5 o'clock. That is enough Tokyo Mirage Sessions. So, oh, stretch. Yep, stretch. So, I hope everyone uh, had fun. It, it's a really fun uh, RPG. I really, I really do like this game, and hopefully I will find the time to actually play through the whole thing. I'm almost done with the uh, Astral Chain. I need to, I need to finish that up. I'm on the last chapter, I think. So, I'm probably gonna finish that up today, and I think I'll go back to um, uh, Tokyo Mirage Sessions and see if I actually get through the whole thing this time. But what you all want to know is next week, what are we playing? Well, next week, we start in on Trails in the Sky, the third. Oh yeah, we are starting that up. So, uh, I know you all have been looking forward to that, as have I, and really excited to get back into that world. So, I hope you will join me. Uh, in the meantime, I hope you all have an excellent week. Uh, take care, everyone. Bye-bye.